Why are you guys being so mean to my title? What? What? Ha it's not bad. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> it's a cute title. You don't like it? It's bright and cheerful. It's happy. I'm not that late. Shut up. You want to know why I'm late? <laughs> I'll show you in a second. I was actually creating content. Good title, Cody. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thanks, Everett. Thank you, Play Tonto. I thought it was a cute title, and I thought you would like it. I made it for you. Thanks, James. Normally, James. Cody, how do I get over my ex? Uh, don't think about it so much, man. Just stop thinking about it. Just don't think about it anymore. I think what you'll probably notice if you like pay attention to your behavior is the more you think about it, the worse you feel. So if you just stop, you'll probably be okay. Did you see Doug Doug beat you and only up? Dude, when I raided Doug... <laughs> When I raided Doug, he challenged me out of nowhere to a game I played once. What was that? What did I do? Doug was shit-talking you hard. Dude, I played it for like an hour. <laughs> well, no, I played it for a whole stream. But still, I, I didn't, like, he like roped me into this challenge. And I can't do it. I'm leaving on Thursday. He was like, who could get the best time and only up by Friday? I'm gone. I'm leaving soon. Oh, hi, Bobby. No way Doug would do that. I can't believe he did. That shit came out of nowhere. What did I do? Bro, roped me into a challenge out of nowhere. Guess you lose? I guess so. You're not baiting me into that. Think I'm going to cancel my vacation? Call them up. I can't make it, actually. I have to win 250 gift subs, maybe. Thank you, your boy, JT. Thank you, Sora. Oh! Hey! Congrats! Hey! First off, calm down. I understand that you're excited. Please keep it low. <laughs> Relax, Bart. But yes, congratulations getting to iron. Well done. I was watching Mango play last night. Mango's in silver. Now, he does play Ryu, who isn't very good. But I was like, damn! Let's go, Mango! How's my diamond streamer? Oh, you know, just living it up, sparkling. Ryu isn't good. He's not bad, but he's not very good. Um, so the reason I was late is because I was making <laughs> this stupid video. I was walking my dogs at 7 p.m. And I, I had this idea pop into my head. <laughs> And you ever have something that you have to get out of your brain right away? This is so stupid. It was in my head, and I was like, I can't do anything until this is out. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna play this while I, I make a tweet. Here you go. If you buy one margarita, <laughs> he will. <laughs> I thought that was really funny. I just thought that was really funny. <laughs> you don't think so? I thought it was really funny. I think the grab is what gets it. Come on. How long did that take you? Like 45 minutes. <laughs> I'm not very good at this. It took me a while. But you want to know why? I had to record all the footage. 
because all the Jamie Drink guys are like people telling you what they do and how to do it and why it's good or not and all that other cringe shit. I just wanted the game and the sound. Did you go into training mode? Yes! I had to do it myself. It was a good effort, Coney. I thought it was funny. <laughs> Yippee! Coney is live. That's what he's thinking. Yippee! <laughs> I probably should do these more. I love these. His ass is thinking. I love those things for some reason. Did you see the Von Wagner clip? Another one? No. This is too relaxing. Oh, much better. Oh. Yeah? Played Pittman this week for the first time. I liked it a lot, but damn, I hate those burrowing birds. Yeah, the snagrits. The burrowing snagrit. Hold on. Uh, chicken stock sound effect. They make this sound. No. What's that one? No. You know the one. How do I find this? Bacock. Yeah, Bacock! <laughs> How do you find that? These all have the same sound effects. No. Chicken Bacock sound effect. I don't know how to even look for it. Look up the yell. Death sound, but close enough. <laughs> That's a very funny sound. That's the one. That's the one I mean. <laughs> oh my god. A chicken demon from hell. I love that. Thank you, Dr. POTUS. That's such a good sound effect. It really is. New dono alert? That's a little loud, right? Don't you think so? Hold on. <laughs> Will you say... Happy birthday to your grandmother on your stream. She's wanted to see you. She likes your chicken demon. <laughs> Happy birthday, Mammy! Thanks for watching my stream. My That's my actual grandma watching the stream now. <laughs> that's Mammy. Yes, that's my grandma. Hi, Mammy. <laughs> you remember the, the my, my grandma that I told you guys the story about how I threw a controller at her head? It's that one. That's Mammy. <laughs> Mammy, I told them the story about how I got really mad at a video game when I was young and I threw a controller at your head and they all... <laughs> I, just, I, I want you to know that that story is now legend in this chat. Terrible grandson. Well, she was cheating. So, you know, I... How bl she's not blameless. I'm not saying that she deserved all that, but, you know, she was kind of... She was kind of hamming it up, right? We all feel bad for you. For me, thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, I went through a lot. Yeah. Like I said, we, we evened it out, though, because she threw me into a closet once. I was jumping on the bed, and she she fucking Honda slammed me. Like a hip toss. Dude, Iron Man was such bullshit. He's just blasting down. <laughs> you always say that. You love cheating. No, I don't. I hate cheating, actually. I don't think it's fair. No one feels bad for you, Coney. That chatter did. He said he did. Coney, you have to play this. What the fuck? I'll be the judge of that. What's this? Bootlegs, bro. Pokemon League of Legends. Yo! Oh my god! Get that for me. It's only $12? Dude, what? Two great things that go great together. Pokemon League of... <laughs> what does that look like? Oh, it's all going to be Pokemon Unite. I searched for it, and it's all Pokemon Unite. Man. Thank you, Issa. Howdy. Yippee indeed. That's a fat wahoo. Did you see the $390 version of Tears of the Kingdom? No. Here's the first time Apollo has said chicken. Yes, that's chicken. Good job, Apollo. 
I hate birds. I hate all birds. Why, why is this bird pretending to be another bird? What does he hope to gain? What does Apollo stand to gain from this? <laughs> Thank you. It meant the world to you. I love you, Mammy. I hope I'll see you soon. My family lives in uh, Michigan now, so I don't get to see them very often. So everybody, drink it up for Mammy. <laughs> Michigan W, I guess. I hate Michigan. I'm not a big fan of it either, but I go in the cold months, so. A chicken. <laughs> I hate birds, dude. I really do. Pokemon League of Legends. You can now play the concept in some characters of League of Legends and Pokemon. This is a champion. Oh, Ezreal gives you fizz. They're selling this for $12. Ash against Fiora. A female Ash, too. This is so stupid. Wait, so can anybody do this? Can anybody just buy ROM or get ROMs from the internet and then sell them? You can do that? That's like mad illegal. Is it illegal? Is it illegal? Because it's not piracy. It well, yeah. It is illegal because it's built on Pokemon, clearly. <laughs> this is not an original game. It is illegal. Very illegal. Uh, Nintendo will kill you. Okay, well, I shan't be doing that then. Nintendo doesn't know what Etsy is. <laughs> speaking of... Speaking of uh, legally dubious products and paraphernalia... Dude. Hold on. God bless. Friend of the stream, non-binary. <laughs> right here. For uh for linking this to me. Catch this tomorrow at 8 p.m. I, I gotta get this, dude. I'm getting this. <laughs> dude, look at that. This shirt goes hard. <laughs> look at that! Hey, maybe Stir Fry. Thank you, Arcane Engine, for the five gifties. Thank you, Keith Frizzle. Thank you! I don't know how Coney is any European fans. It's 1 a.m. right now. I don't. My Euro viewers are starving. Thank you, Breadbox. Link. So this is made by the um, Momono World guys who made these shirts. <laughs> Cloud at McDonald's. Leon at Arby's. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Sora at 7 Eleven. I don't know what that clipping sound effect was. Like... Um, Sephiroth at Burger King? Oh, this is where the Garfield Sonic shirt came from. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, they have a Mario RPG shirt. That's cute. I like that. If I like the game, I might get it. <laughs> Sonic Adventure. They didn't even change the word Sonic. That's not Sonic. That X is pretty... Oh, that's actually kind of... That shirt goes hard. Why is Snake at Jack in the Box? Family dinner at Olive Garden. That would make sense. I've seen that movie. Uh, Dante at Pizza Hut, he would go there. Yeah, so there's like a strong focus on, uh, Sonic, as you can see. Wario and Waluigi at Wawa. Damn, they have a lot of shirts. I didn't know they had all this. <laughs> Sid at the Cracker Barrel? Why? He's just old. Barrett at Chili's? These are so dumb. There's Ronald again. Why is he? They are, dude, this this is actually promotion that I usually charge people for. And I'm just going through their whole catalog. Old, he's 32. Sid is not 32. Shut up. <laughs> Yoshi. I haven't seen all these. We got a jam-packed stream tonight. Unironically, for real. We got a lot of stuff to do. Um, I leave for vacation on Thursday. So I'm going to be gone Thursday until next week. Where's Krakow at the Outback? Krakow wouldn't eat at the Outback. Krakow wouldn't eat food. He eats condensation. He's a clout. Dude, I actually like this. I don't know why. <laughs> why is it only 20 bucks? These shirts are so cheap. 
This is a Monono World ripoff? This is this is Momono World. Are they different? I think that's what Isn't that the same thing? Did you mean Momono? Cause these are ripoffs. Wait, really? <laughs> I don't know what Momono, Monono, Monono world. Oh, that's different. No, it's not. Monono is this. <laughs> I don't know what that is. It's just a parody. I, dude, I don't know enough about high fashion. I just found out what like Balenciagas were like six months ago. The parrot knows Wario, by the way. Wario. <laughs> Correct. Sure is. Wario. Yep. Wario. 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 I want to mod my Switch so that this guy is the announcer voice. Wario. 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 His ass does not need to be saying Wario that much. There's not enough Wario happenings in the world. Bro got Wario. one game. Wario. Wario. <laughs> Don't hold up Wario as if he wasn't going to say that anyway. Oh, yeah, he knows Wario. No, he just says that. Wario. 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 <laughs> Wario. What do you have to say? Wario. This bird loves Wario. Is his comfort game, I guess. Hey, ads in 10 seconds. I don't know what to tell you. Pay up, sucker. Tier 1 sub is only $4.99 a month, but you can do it with Twitch Prime. I will allow it this time. If you go below the stream, you might have a Twitch Prime and not even realize it. Go to click, subscribe. Oh, my God, that popped immediately. S sub now. Oh, they're, they're gone. They get subs. Never mind. I remember when partners got no ads for free. Yeah, they're squeezing, bro. They're trying to get every drop at us. You see that hype chat shit? Why did they do that? What was that all about? Taking more money. Wario. <laughs> all right. It's a lot to do tonight. Busy, busy, busy. Dude. This tweet bombed. 400 oh, likes in... 30 minutes. I thought that shit was funny. It's really just YouTube poop humor. I think that's the issue. It's a great tweet. Oh, it's very funny. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> this is very funny. But it is old funny, right? This is YouTube poop funny, right? Zoomers are, are, are a different breed now. This is way too long. <laughs> yeah, I need a zoomer brain to, to cut this up. Shit's 40 seconds long. Then you cut it up. I had 30 minutes. I had 30 minutes before I went live. That shit was funny. Literally remove all pauses. I'm trying to help the world by lengthening the average uh, attention span. That's really why I made that tweet. I made it a little bit longer to help you guys. Check this out. I forgot he was back there, and I closed a bunch of tabs, and he was there. Look at my tweet, Coney. Okay. Funniest fake leak of all time. An egg? <laughs> yeah. Sure is. Thanks, Pweenie. Pweenie? Pweenie? Thank you. I'm not clicking links anymore. You guys, I, I'm done doing that. No more clicking links. I've clicked my last link. Why did Gorilla post <laughs> hype chat with $10? You're giving Twitch $3. Don't do that. Got any leaks, Coney? <laughs> Big stuff coming soon, bro. <laughs> Listen, I love Luminosity, but I I don't like the, the all the big stuff coming soon tweets. Like, let's just do some stuff. You know what I mean? Let's pot. Let's do shit. You know what I mean? Let's get the channel up. 
That's because I do big shit coming soon. I do that all the time. You got to build the hype. The hype's already there. We've signed like six players. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> we have six players. Let's fucking do it. Thank you, Godoy, for the five. Thanks for the five. An iconic five, Godoy. Thank you. Okay. So, Kony, did you ever start Chibi Robo? No, I, I was going to do it on the side stream. Uh, speaking of the side stream, if you guys didn't see it, you guys missed out, bro. We were on the side stream yesterday to get to Diamond, and unfortunately that VOD is dead because I don't say VODs or clips. But uh friend of the stream, Joe, actually, uh, he saved one. Don't let me lose this. It'd be very <laughs> hard. Shit. I'm beating it with the scrubbiest shit ever. Yeah, I just mashed L1 and I was winning. Cody, when is the Combat Warrior stream going to be? Uh, I don't know. Sometime soon. Probably when I get back from vacation. We'll pop one of those. Cody, you stream at 4 a.m. for me. Well, then leave the stream on in case I have a bounty or if I need to pop ads. Why don't you do that for me? Oh, my God. I had it recommended on the side. Dude, I realized <laughs> somebody pointed this out. If I tweet, hey, playing Pikmin on the side stream, and then I, I'm the only person playing Pikmin... It's very easy to find me. Yeah. I get recommended a lot. If you're a Kony viewer, you're probably going to get recommended the side stream. But don't watch it unless you're a sub, okay? <laughs> I didn't want to do it. Uh, I, I don't want to hop on the main stream. Like, I started this stream at, like, 1130 last night. And I don't want to do that for, like, an hour-long stream. So sometimes I'll do side streams. Uh, tomorrow... Or not tomorrow. The next game I'm probably going to play is Chibi Robo. Maybe on the side thing, because... I don't know. We'll see. But... Yeah. Good not to hurt the algo? I mean, maybe. It's more that I don't want to do short streams on here. I want to keep my schedule. You know what I mean? So... Kony, if you played Doshin and the Giant... I forgot about that game. Dude. What is that? <laughs> there he is. Isn't he God? Aren't you God in this game? I remember hearing about this in a game magazine, but I don't think it ever came out, did it? Oh, it was on 64? Thank you, Can He beat Goku, though. If you're talking about Popeye, yes, he could. Popeye beat the shit out of Goku. I might try this. Does he have a butt? That's fan art. Kony, where's the Honda gameplay? Maybe tonight. If you guys are good, maybe we pop some Street Fighter Night. I might pop a cheeky bit of Honda. Honestly, I don't want Honda to be... I don't know. Honda doesn't sound fun in Plat 1. You know? Yeah, tomorrow we're playing the Pikmin 4 demo. Woohoo. I don't know when it drops, though. I don't know if I'm going to have time during the stream. Try a new character. I don't know how many more... Uh, I don't know how many more characters I have to place. Cringe confessional when? I don't know. We were going to do it another time soon, but I don't think we're doing it tomorrow. We'll see. What happened to the Marissa? I don't like her. She's cringe. Okay, I have something very important that I have to... That, that I have to do. Something came out today, and I haven't seen it. It's not a sponsor. It's not a sponsor. Why are you doing that? Why are you guys doing that? It's not a sponsor. I'm curious because today, new trailer for Five Nights at Freddy's. Five Nights, Five Nights, Five Nights. It's the only thing we like more than Fortnite. We love Five Nights. Get on in here. I saw Nirette said that it looks like Jimmy Neutron CGI. I want to know what the budget is for this. I'm curious. Maybe it'll be good. Trailer bangs, does it? I'll be the judge of that. Hi, this is Mike. I was just calling to see if that job Mike job that you offered was still available. Yes. The security. That's a reference. Take anything. Please watch on YouTube. Oh yeah, I forgot the quality. <laughs> Sorry, one sec. 
<laughs> this just got recommended to me. Marissa's voice actor reads thirst tweets <laughs> by the voice actor for Luke. You're in it? <laughs> really? Because <laughs> I, cause I, I raided that night, right? <laughs> oh, man. This generation is doomed. Do we have to watch it now? No, we don't. <laughs> I, I'm in it for like probably 10 seconds. The animatronics are real. They're made by the Jim Henson workshop. They're not CGI. Wait, Jim Henson made Freddy? <laughs> I don't like that. Freddy is technically a Muppet? His company. Yeah, but that's him. Freddy's a Muppet now. <laughs> oh my god. Hi, this is Mike. I was just calling to see if Mike? the job that you offered was still available. Yes. The security guard. I will take anything. <laughs> this place was huge in the 80s with the kids. They shut it down years ago. The owner's He's just not ready to let it go yet. I will work and you will sleep. I understand. Why did they give him a kid? Oh, so he has something to fight yeah. for. Why would you watch this? Oh, oh producer of Megan. Apparently, that's a good ass movie. Thank you, Sinnoh Man. Was that Foxy Coney? No way that was Foxy. <gasps> Dude, I could I could make a video. Five Nights trailer deconstructed. Is that Chica and Bonnie? And could there be prizes? <laughs> could this be the Freddy Fazbear? It would get 41 million views. What a reference. All you have to do is keep your eyes on the Thank monitor. you, Lewa. Thank you for the prime. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's, where fantasy and fun come to life. Okay. What has this guy been in after Hunger Games? Like, I don't want to be rude, but, like, does he... Hunger Games too? <laughs> like, he didn't do much after. And I'm not, like, bagging on him. You know, Hollywood is brutal, but... Indie stuff mainly. Yeah, good for him if that's what he wants, right? I think he did a few plays like most actors. Oh, W, okay. A stage actor. He was Joel in The Last of Us. No, he wasn't. That's not him. Okay. You saw bootleg. You must be a new security guard. Can I uh, help you, officer? Have you met them yet? <laughs> met who? I guess you need more characters. Um. Sure, yeah. Who? That does look like CGI. Was that Freddy? Could it be? That looks real, though. The cupcake looks real. Play five shows at Wario's. <laughs> Wait. Is that real? Oh, it's like a full game? <laughs> oh, Waluigi's crazy. This is stupid. Wario wasn't even there. Is this a license? 
That's a real arcade game. That one's like everywhere. Did they have to pay to be in this? The Cyclone game? I love Cyclone. In the 80s, kids went missing. Uh-huh. The police searched Freddy's top to bottom. Hello? They never found them. That's why the place shut down. I just realized we're gonna get like eight of these. There are ghost children possessing giant robots. <laughs> Thanks for the heads up. Oh, they're spoiling that. They're saying it straight up. Huh. I thought they would leave that to mystery. Technically, they're animatronics. Well, Unless they're this flops. Do you think there's a world where it does? I don't think it does. But maybe I'm overestimating the power of the internet and the interest of online people. Who cares about FNAF anymore? Nobody, but that's why you make a movie. This is nostalgia bait. Oh my god, I loved this nine years ago. Think about this. Noodle this one, okay? Five Nights started in what, 2014? Right? I think 2014? If somebody is, you know, 12 when Five Nights comes out, perfect age ideal age for this kind of bullshit, right? 12 years old when Five Nights comes out. They are now 21. Like, yeah, I was 13. That's me. Dude! Seeing the game that overtook, that you got hyper fixated on as a dumb kid brought to the big screen, you don't think there's millions of people like that out there? This is the perfect age for this. I am literally who are you referring to, and I want to be as far as possible from this. Well, you're not... <laughs> you don't speak for everybody, okay? And make her... Although that's... I don't know if that's true. Because also, like, that was a big deal for me. Because, like, seeing movies of stuff that I was into when I was a kid was a big deal. But now it's so oversaturated. We've seen so many different combinations of, like, media crossovers that the, the gimmick is probably dead. Like them. Bobby. Probably doesn't matter anymore. Tell me how to stop them. <laughs> it's too late. <laughs> Bobby, go! Those are not Jim Henson puppets. Bobby, go! That's CGI. Look at them. Those are not puppets. Those are CGI as hell, and not even good CGI. It's not CGI. It fucking is! Look at that! It's literally not. <laughs> We're living in the misinformation era. That That's CGI, right? Coney, did you see that they put a, a baby in the microwave in the Flash movie? <laughs> I did. Yeah, I did see that. They did do that. Yeah, they put a baby in the microwave, and I, I'll just spoil this. Who gives a shit? Nicolas Cage shows up. I saw that tweet, or that, yeah, that tweet, that spoiler or whatever. Yeah. Christopher Reeve shows up, which is very weird, because he's been dead for a long time. Ezra Miller just did that on set. They happened to film it. It was in his contract, yeah. He ha he gets to do one of those a week during filming. So they really had to push production along, right? That microwave was getting kind of dirty. Apparently they're real. I don't believe you. Not that shot, at least. He's in this movie? Isn't this the... God, I feel like such a... <laughs> I feel like such a fucking geek. But that's Springtrap, right? He's not supposed to be in the first movie. <laughs> right? <laughs> this is embarrassing that I know this. Thank you, Dr. Real. FNAF historian. Yeah, that's me. A FNAF maniac. Yup. 34-year-old Coney 
knowing about FNAF lore. That's me. <laughs> Vanessa's in this one. Oh, I didn't even realize that was her. You're right. Uh, very scary. Wow. Why do I always get the weirdos? Why do I always get the weirdos? That's CGI, dude. That's not real. That's not real. I'm looking at it right now. That is not real. It's real. No, it's not. Look at it. That's not... Look at how... Look at the way the focus works. Look at his eye, dude. It's a mix. Hold on. Do you guys remember the Sonic stand-in in the Sonic movie? I, I shouldn't have... I didn't know how to type this. You know... You guys know how in the Sonic movie they had the stand-in? The stand-in model? That's what you probably saw. You probably saw this, but for Freddy. And you're like, oh my god, it's real. That's not... It. You're seeing this. That's not real. That's a fucking computer. Dude. Be working with Jim Henson's Creature Shop. Yes, for the fucking stand-in. You are seeing the Sonic. When was this tweeted? August 9, 2022. They gave up on that shit. That's too hard. Full-size animatronics? No, I'm not doing that. It's CG. It's not real. These are real. But these are not what were in the trailer. Those are real. The trailer was not. No, they're not. They're not. You will not convince me that is a real thing right there. That is, though. That, that's a real one right there. Bonnie is blue here, normally purple. I don't know. I don't care. This is so stupid. This is so dumb. Wait, streaming on Peacock day one? Why? Why are they doing that? They do not expect it to do well. I guess not. Uh, theaters might not work. I mean, yeah, I agree. I don't, I don't know if releasing this into the wild would be the right play. I thought it would, but... I'm watching this. Am I allowed to do it? <laughs> All right, theoretically, if I made an account on Kick, and it was my first <laughs> stream there... Could I possibly, <laughs> could there be a way, hypothetically, just spitballing, if I considered an option where maybe I was on kick, right? Absolutely yes. Lock it in. Good. I'll see you there. This and Twisted Metal Watch Party. <laughs> oh, my God. Get that show away from me, dude. That show, I it's it's horrific, truly unbelievable, man. That show, nothing has broken my heart like that. As, as in bad, yes, as in bad, dude. It's awful. The twisted metal trailer is one of the worst things I've ever seen. The cab driver is Corey Kenshin. I don't know who that is. I saw you guys saying who it was and popping off. I think I saw a, a YouTube video of him being mad at YouTube. There is some, like, controversy, and he was mad at YouTube. The YouTuber. That doesn't help me. I don't know YouTubers. <laughs> oh, yeah, that guy. Like, I don't, I'm not. Like, I grew up on Tom Cruise and George Clooney and shit. You watched PewDiePie and this guy. We're not the same. And now you watch me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That I, I watched Al Pacino, and you enjoy um, T-1000. 
T-Series? Who's a big YouTuber? Markiplier? <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Beast. That was the first one I should have thought of. Why didn't I think of Mr. Beast? My bad. No wonder Coney is a Scientologist. Hey, it just makes sense. Got to cleanse out my thetans. You know what I'm saying? Hope you guys cleanse your thetans today. My thetans be going crazy. Right, fellas? <laughs> I hate those thetans. Pray Xenon. Yup. Every day. Are they going to have Markiplier gaming in the pizzeria? Is he in the movie? Is he in there too? Yeah. Imagine an after credit scene that <laughs> breaks down the lore of everything we just watched. A 30 minute video after the movie ends. As soon as the movie ends, welcome everyone to another MatPat video. Everybody's like. <laughs> that sounds terrific. New DSP tweet. Oh, <gasps> can't miss this. Oh my God. This is like Christmas for me. I love these so much. I genuinely love these every time. <laughs> Doesn't work. Hold R, press up, release. No, nope. still brings out the arrows. <laughs> Still brings out the arrows. I can't tell if he's right or wrong. I haven't played this game. What's he trying to do? I can't tell. I don't know what he's... He Maybe he's spinning. Press R. Nope. <laughs> he's pressing ZR, not R. Press re oh. <laughs> regular R. Hold up. Release. Oh, is that it? Is that oh, is he pressing up on the D-pad? Not on... <laughs> That all I had to do. A single regular bomb took 11 hearts and insta killed me. Okay, that is a little crazy. How strong is that bomb? Bomb flower. I, I guess it. You? That seems kind of powerful. That seems a little strong, right? A single regular bomb took. He doesn't have 11 hearts. <laughs> He's exaggerating for effect. Did you pause and count? Did you watch this? Pause and say one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He was almost right. He was actually very close. Was that it? Is that all I had to do? <laughs> Not bad. A single regular bomb took 11 hearts and insta-killed me. <laughs> and then didn't even break the wall. Do you see what I mean about this game's mechanics? They suck. I'm Is he, like, hate-playing the whole game? I'm sorry. They suck. They s fucking That's suck. That's amazing. So he's not stopping, and this is like a hundred hour game. One says you can kiss the fucking Miyamoto and Nintendo's That's awesome. You want. The game mechanics are terrible. You he stop. has the fucking Master Sword. Can't even do something easily in the game. It's like a chore to figure out a baby's mechanic in this game. And then, oh, ho, 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 the bomb insta-kills you. The bomb didn't insta-kill you in any fucking Zelda game ever before. Ever. <laughs> Not once did that ever happen until today. Not to any other player. It's never happened to anyone in any game except today. To him. Only to him. They, this game is absolutely ridiculous with the game mechanics. Dude, I, I can't even be mad. He's, I, I have been DSP before. When I when I play Street Fighter, I feel like DSP. If I fight a Cami and they don't immediately fight me, I just I get so mad. <laughs> if a Cami doesn't immediately fight and jump into me, I get so annoyed. I'm like, dude, come on. Why are you playing Cami? Why are you down backing? I fight a Ken and he's just doing this. Why would you pick that? Pick Guile if you're scared. And that's my, I don't know why I do that. I don't know. I'm, I'm DSP when it comes to fighting games. Dude, I fought the final boss of Pikmin 1 on side stream. That boss is fucked up. Dude, the final boss of that game is so stupid. On GameCube. It got better on the other games. But on GameCube, it's so bad. 
It's awful. You were DSPing last night. Yeah, but I hit Diamond, though. <laughs> I was DSPing. We all have a little DSP in us. That's the nature of the beast. That's why he is so... I think that's why he's so appealing. You felt this way, right? You felt this way before. You know that you have. You just don't express it, especially not publicly on the internet. We all have half a DSP in us. I don't know if it's half. It's it's the varying degrees, but... Oh, Reds at Orioles. <laughs> Who said damn rip? <laughs> That's trending now. Thanks, buttface. Thanks for the prime. I'm not a DSP. I'm a low-tier god. <laughs> How much money do you think it would take to get a first to ten between those two? And they get a mic during and after every game. I would kill for that. They get a mic. Like, they can talk during the game, but maybe after the game. I, I feel like... <laughs> I feel like low-tier god would be so mean... That low tier god would like, or that DSP would like shrivel up. He would stop talking. Or he would just laugh really loud until low tier god stopped. Just ha 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 wow! Ha 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 Cover the sadness with a smile. Yeah, exactly. Arrange that urgently, please. There's got to be a way to get those two to game together, man. That would be tremendous. <laughs> okay. So, listen, fellas. A long time ago, there was a Smash YouTuber, okay? And he was one of the most famous Smash YouTubers in the world. He made Smash content, and everybody loved it, and they tuned into every single video. It was tremendous. And then he went away for years. For, I think, two years? Let me look. Two long, agonizing years. He disappeared, vanished off the face of the earth until <laughs> just two days ago. Everyone, I would like to uh, introduce you to GR Smash. Now, you may have heard of GR Trash. You might know GR Trash, because he's the ultimate guy. But GR Smash is the original, 259K. Has made excellent movies since time immemorial. 7 million views. 4 million views. Am I in this video? I don't think I'm in this video at all. 4 million views. 3 million views. This guy is huge. Very big. I remember the Rage videos. <laughs> Rage videos seem kind of distasteful now, don't they? Oh, there's Sago. <laughs> I love Sago. The guy on the right is Sago, who's a, uh, I think he played Luigi in uh, PM or something. He's from Illinois. I think that's what it is. Thank God I'm not in there. Oh, my God. This moment is so sad. <laughs> so, oh, that, that one hurts. That one is real. I can't watch it. I really can't watch this one again, that particular moment. That clip, it's really, it's really messed up. Show it? No. It's uncomfortable. Let's just forget it happened. I'm not going to do it. Anyway, uh, he's back to posting, at least for one day, with Smash's strangest rivalry, Denny's versus IHOP. I heard about this crew battle a long time ago. It was in PM, and apparently he's making some uh, video essay videos now. Which is tremendous. Also, I didn't watch this, I swear. I just, I, it's autoplay. I did not pre-watch it. I swear. He's, he's making some long-form stuff, some video essays, and I love to see it. Let's take a look at Smash's strangest rival, rival, we, <laughs> whoops. Let's take a look at Smash's strangest rivalry. Shut up, Wival Wee. I didn't say Wival Wee. I just got my R's mixed up a little bit. YouTube is hard. I can do Twitch all day. The YouTube stuff is hard. What is Smash's strangest rivalry? Comment below. Do you like Denny's or IHOP? I'm a Waffle House guy. Everybody says Waffle House. I don't think anybody cares. Like, everybody says Waffle House all the time. Wival schools. 
<laughs> He's saying that. All right, let's smash the strangest rivalry, shall we? So, when it comes to Smash, there are typically three ways players will face off. Singles, which consists of two players engaging in a one-on-one -on -one battle. Doubles, which consists of four players engaging in a two-on-two -two battle. I don't think you needed to go this in depth. I think you could, I think people would get the, okay. We're really casting the widest net possible. We're trying to be as, as comprehensive and throw as we can be. And finally, the crew battle, which consists of two teams of many players who face off in a series of one-on-ones until one team has no players remaining. Or squad strike. Hmm. What about squad strike? Nobody likes squad strike. Now today I've got a story about a crew battle for you, and I think it's a pretty interesting one. Today I'm going to be telling be you about an event that. that is simultaneously both the strangest and also one of the greatest that Smash has ever seen. Wait, did they so have way back skins? In 2016, a crew battle occurred within the Arizona Project M community, <laughs> but this one was different. Now crew battles are not a commonly done thing. Due to the Dude, amount of coordination and planning ugly. they require from so many. Now, Do you ever forget that we had that that Slippy like changed everything for us? Look at this ugly ass game. Captain Falcon's stomach is so jagged. <laughs> Fox, I can't even tell what he's supposed to be. It's a blob on the ground. A commonly done thing. Standard Due depth to the is gross. Coordination and planning they require from so many Fizzy people, saved us. They're typically a large event, and there's usually some sort of oh, underlying you. reason for having one, such as a long-standing regional rivalry. Ireland, Britain, right? <laughs> Phew. <laughs> uh, not Britain? Are they not? <laughs> oh, my God. Are, are Great Britain and England not the same? Close enough. I don't... Britain is not England. <laughs> are you fucking kidding? Wait, so Britain includes Scotland and Wales. I thought that was the United Kingdom. Are you serious? Then what's the United Kingdom? UK is Britain and Northern Ireland. Okay, so, so okay, so so the UK is Britain, Britain is England, Scotland, Wales. England is its own thing. England has London, right? It's literally called the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. Yeah, but br this is so stupid. However, this crew battle... Watch the CGP Grey video. No. <laughs> I'm never going to Europe. I don't care. Occurred ...because of possibly I don't the get greatest it. reason for a crew battle ever. Yeah, you gotta admit it's a bit messy. Yeah, chat just wants to dogpile me. Like, I'm supposed to know that. It makes no sense. This crew battle occurred over a long-standing argument that split the entire Arizona Project M community in half over which restaurant was better, IHOP or Denny's. Now, as ridiculous as... For which restaurant was better? IHOP? You could tell just by the look of it, man. Look at this. IHOP has this, like, weird ranch aesthetic with the stone. It looks too serious, man. It looks like a steakhouse. Like, you could take out the IHOP thing, and it would just look like a, an Outback or something. Ranch? Yeah, it's like ranch style, right? With the, I don't know, with the roofs. Or Denny's. Right? Denny's looks real. It's brick. You could put this into any alley in America. Take this into the city. I don't like how this is a little pretentious, the stone on top, but the brick house is fantastic. Now, as ridiculous as this sounds, it gets even better. Pull it? I don't want to. <laughs> I think we know the answer. Firstly, in case you didn't already know, Project M, or PM for short, was a fan-made mod of Super Smash Bros. Brawl made by a talented group of Brawl modders. We sought to make Brawl more competitive and more akin to a successor of Melee. Really? It was one year after? How long were they working on it? They succeeded. That's the crazy. Gaining mass popularity in 2014. But I remember expected, Brawl Plus. Since this is an actual creative and interesting mod of their game that people <laughs> enjoyed, Daddy oh Nintendo God. wasn't too happy. And Nintendo has done countless things over the years in efforts to kill PM entirely, with it essentially now considered to be an outcast game in comparison to kill PM entirely, with it essentially now considered criminal activity? Like a felony? Like you could go to jail for that. 
you actual litigation beyond like a, a C and D. To be an outcast Holy game shit. in comparison to Melee that can't or be true. Ultimate as a result. That's an exaggeration. So sure. Desire to satisfy Nintendo or any huge corporate sponsors, the remaining PM communities and players have a lot of freedom and can be inters. The remaining PM communities and players have a lot of freedom. Yeah, don't go here. Dude, the first time I saw this, I was like, what, is, what the fuck is this? <laughs> there was a time where everybody that was good at PM... I hop one? Dude, what? I thought this was a gimme. Denny's is Garbo. What the fuck are you talking? Oh my god, this is pissing me off. I genuinely, in my heart of hearts, cannot fathom somebody preferring IHOP. Like, I can't, I can't put that in together in my brain. The, the, the neurons don't match up. I can't sync these two things together. Run it again. Why? <laughs> Why is it going to be different this time? You're going to pay so Denny's wins? You're going to pay some bits? Maybe watch some ads? And can be you can get a full meal for like thirteen dollars at Denny's. That shit is like six. the The grand slam is like six bucks. Has eggs, bacon, sausage, pancakes. Interesting to so say the stupid. least. He just, he just... And this crew battle, in my opinion, is a perfect representation of that. But still, the obvious question is why. How did this crew battle actually <laughs> even come Falcon? about? Well, Arizona has always been one of the strongest communities for PM. And for many scenes, it's extremely common procedure after a tournament for players to head out to a late night restaurant. Yeah. But in Arizona in particular, there was a for players to head out to a late night restaurant. But in Arizona, I have never seen people go to an Uno. The culture is usually a diner. It's it's either Denny's or IHOP or like Korean barbecue if it's early. People love Korean barbecue. You guys don't know Uno? How do you guys not know what Uno is? Uno is huge, I thought. Uno is a, it's a pizza place. They got, like, deep dish, like Chicago style. You guys don't know Uno? Never heard of it. It's not bad. It's, uh, it's, it's pretty good. It's very buttery. Like, the crust is mad buttery and fatty. Oh, by the way, while we're talking, guess where I went for the first time today? I, uh, I was talking with the guy that runs SmashCon, because we had a meeting to talk about, um... You know, what he's, what the plans are, what's going on. And he was like, hey, let's go to Glory Days. And I said, what is Glory Days? This is Glory Days Grill. It's disgusting. There was nothing on the menu that was under a thousand calories. I went to the salads. A Cobb salad was 1600. There was not a single thing. Look at those PNGs, yeah. Taco Tuesday. <laughs> uh, he got wings, and I got a crab thing. I got a crab dip thing, but it was allergen wizard. <laughs> Very spooky. What a horrible power that would be. Don't pick any. Don't pick any. He will use it against you. <laughs> Allergic to tree nuts, I see. And he just casts a spell that grows three trees around you. <laughs> Full of nuts. You can't move at all. They all just start tumbling down. Lupin? I don't know what Lupin is. That food is going to do a reverse Lorax on the endocrine system. What's Lupin? I know Loop. I knew it was going to do that. Lupin food. Oh, it's a bean. Okay. I was curious. Oh, while we're stun locked anyway, hey, uh, if you guys didn't see, <laughs> uh, we put out a YouTube video yesterday. I hope you guys liked it. It's on a game called Tactical. That's right, Tactical. Oh, boy. Listen, you don't have to download it or watch this video. You don't have to do anything. I'm already getting paid. But I wanted you to know, if you want to get Jason in Tactical, which is this game. Check it out. Game of the year. I actually did have fun filming this video. You're not going to believe. I actually did enjoy it. Seriously.
That game looked like it could have popped off mid-2010s. I liked it. It was fun. Nah, I'm good. Okay, well, I thought I should show it to you. <laughs> I thought you might like it. Wow, my stream turned off randomly. <laughs> as soon as Tactical showed up, it just... <laughs> Dude, I went crazy in that game, and I was definitely fighting real people. Arizona in particular, there was a constant heated debate every single week. Tony, how much power do you have at Tactical? I started out with Lucky, now I have 10 million power. Where did you get Lucky? How did you unlock Lucky? Speak <laughs> about whether to go to IHOP or... That's an embarrassing-ass name. I'm not asking my waitress for that. I don't care how good of a deal it is. Can I have the super Rudy Tooty fresh and fruity? How about the pancakes? Give me the pancakes. Fruity Tooty fresh and fruity. Come on. What do I look like? <laughs> or Denny's. It ended up becoming oh, so fucking passionate. Jester. Wait, what is that? See, this is why I love Denny's, bro. Hold on. IHOP has these. Um, uh, these ambitions right to be a real restaurant to be something greater to be a place that you would go to for actual food and sustenance and nutrition denny's just put five mozzarella sticks between two pieces of bread and said fuck it eat this there are no a there's nothing aspirational about this meal <laughs> there's nothing pretentious about this right denny's knows why you're there you probably have a hangover or it's very late and you're desperate. Nothing good is open. Whatever. We're going to fry food. And maybe if you're good, we'll toast the bread. That's it. I love how real Denny's keeps it. As opposed to IHOP, which makes you say to your waiter, to again, I would like the super Rudy Tootie Fresh and Fruity. Or they should make their food look grosser. Denny's. I'm not kidding. It ended up becoming so passionate. That's why Waffle House is king. Again, I agree and was so constantly discussed that it essentially became a rite of passage for every player in Arizona to pledge allegiance to either IHOP or Denny's, with one half Dude, of the players choosing IHOP and the other half choosing Denny's. IHOP hype. With massive trash talk from both sides towards the other being pretty much the norm. Now, as a non-American myself, when I first heard about this... Non-American? GR Trash isn't American? Or GR Smash? Canadian. Oh... What do they have up there? Oh, Timmy's. <laughs> I forgot. They got Tim Hortons, right. I was surprised to learn that this is apparently not... And they have Smokies, which is a poutine place, which is awful. Not that uncommon of a debate. Even making it onto an episode of The Office. We meet at the Denny's, no. and we compare notes. No, I never said Denny's. I hop. No, I, hop. I said Denny's. You know Dwight how keeps I feel it real. Just that in the AZPM scene, this debate was cranked up to the max. Clear out that bile. Shoutouts to bad food. That's right. That's a Denny's. No, man. Oh, wow. No. We don't, we don't mention that here. We don't mention Denny's here in Tucson. If you ever in Tucson, you're going to I. Smokes is fast food poutine, and it's perfectly junk junk food. Oh, yeah, Smokes, not Smokies. It was so bad. I, I had Smokes poutine because everybody said I should try poutine, and then I had it, and everybody was like, oh, not that. That's the bad one. Oh. Don't ask us about it. Poutine isn't any different. It's just... It's it's curds and gravy and fries. How can it be good or bad? Anybody can make that. Poutine is disgusting. It had been brewing for years and years, and eventually Finger Stripes, a leader of the AZPM. Which is more bat chess, The Office or Marvel? Marvel. The Office is a good show. People people just hate on it because like it was super popular and you know it's it's like basic personality or whatever. Office is genuinely a good show seen suggested they have a crew battle to finally decide which one truly was better both sides were determined to get to the bottom of it so they agreed two teams were quickly constructed consisting of the very best what is this <laughs> i have not unlocked that character oh it's chef kawasaki oh my god they added him to pm the chef is here that's my guy dude best az hell had yeah finally and instantly the crew battle had massive hype behind it. Finger Stripes, in preparation for the crew battle, then spent weeks creating hype trailers, custom modded, <laughs> insanely detailed. That Nez is so gross. He works there? There have to be laws against that. What the fuck is that? 
<laughs> Child labor. He has a fucking apron. He's got to be a busboy. I feel like Ness's mom works at the IHOP. She's like a waitress, and it, he just has to come there because she can't afford daycare. So yeah, put on an apron, little guy. You're going to help mommy today. Go hand out some straws. Why is everybody linking me this? <laughs> oh, my God. This is today, June 27th. Yup, it's National Sunglasses Day. Hey, Die Jack. Take those stupid sunglasses off. We're inside. He's right. Hey, he's right. It's true. They are indoors, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Scroll down once, Coney. Father, do oh no. Come Tuesday. Von Wagner jump scare. Why is he? Why is he everywhere? I see. Why is he all over the place? It really is. Come Tuesday. <laughs> it's so stupid. It is come Tuesday though. It really is. Why was this tweeted by the actual account? The actual WWE account. Wait a minute. This made me remember Superhuman. How's he been doing? I don't know if I'm allowed to watch this on Twitch. He hasn't jumped in a while, bro. He's just making merch. He's cashing out. I don't think he's got it anymore. <laughs> Do not try this at home. I can't show you this on Twitch. <laughs> You'll have to go to Twitter to figure out what happens next. I hop in Denny's costumes for each competitor. Santa face skillet? Mm. Ah, this is where he keeps the straws. And the this little holster, the straws and the checkbook. Which would be played on custom IHOP and Denny stages. Love that. Now, this is already insane. <laughs> But it gets even better. Okay. With Liam having such a tightly knit community, news of the crew battle spread like wildfire, with many members of the PM community posting support for their favorite side. Denny's yeah. is a better restaurant than IHOP. On Jim Jim! Denny's Master of the Nooch! Or IHOP. IHOP is the house of pancakes. IHOP over Denny's. What is this music? Any day. And some top PM players even offered to come out to Arizona and join the crew battle in support of their preferred side. Hell yeah, dude. Favorite dish, the T-bone steak and shrimp. Oh, that's disgusting. What the fuck? No. Don't get meat at Denny's. A T-bone steak and shrimp? The fuck is that? That's a steakhouse meal. Why would you go to Denny's for that? Leading to so Oh my god. It doesn't even... Oh my god. Never mind. Never mind. These guys don't know how to order at a diner. Joining Team Denny's and I... My favorite meal at IHOP is the lobster. I love the lobster with um, potatoes all gratin. Punch mm -mm. Kids joining Team IHOP. I Punch Kids was specifically brought in to replace Blue. The Coney, have you had the nachos at Denny's? No. <laughs> I don't drink. I've never been in this situation where I've wanted that. Current number one ranked player in Arizona and team ihop member was forced to drop out of the <laughs> he got the pancake shield what do you mean question mark i feel like nachos are a drunk people food like you're drunk and you ended up at denny's i feel like you don't get nachos normally crew battle after he had iron no you get the nachos normally at denny's that's likely suffered food poisoning from a denny's you don't end up at denny's sober yeah i feel like 70 percent of the people that are in denny's are drunk already and of those people, 60% uh, of them are getting nachos. After the last weekly tournament, these two Guys, team I'm trying to watch the video. To Stop. Blue, the current number one ranked player in Arizona and Team IHOP member was forced to drop out of the crew battle after he had ironically suffered food poisoning from the <laughs> after the last weekly tournament. <laughs> oh, he went to Denny's. Oh. This is propaganda. This shit isn't real. I know I know he set this up. These two final additions led That's to the finalized teams. 
two sets of seven no, players that were no. both extremely stacked. It adds up, to be fair. No, I think there's more to that story. Maybe he st he ended up at Denny's, but he actually started at IHOP. Like, he met his friends at IHOP, ate a meal, and then went to Denny's. You know, a lot of things could be possible. And extremely evenly matched. Team Denny's consisted of I Love Bagels, arguably the best Luigi player in the world at the time. Cloudburst, one of the best Squirtles in PM. <laughs> Oreo Milkshake Squirtle? Aw. Also, he's just a person. Flesh Squirtle is weird. That's a little guy. Where does he get water power? Oh, it's milkshake powers. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, did, wait, did he have milkshake particle effects? Oh my god. Damn history. Jesus. Yo! Best player in AZ. <laughs> Why he got two hats? That's so silly. Tier strategist and Danny's team captain. Show me a move. Cobra, Love that. Yep. one of the best Falcon players in AZ. Mm -hmm. Softy. Master of Diddy Kong. Who had just switched to Wolf. <laughs> but, uh... I was trying to see what the wolf was, but I guess we couldn't find a good... Is he, like, a sausage? I don't... Seen... Cute tail, though. He has, like, tails his tail. No wolf. One of the best Mewtwo players in the world. I thought he was an egg. <laughs> I thought it was, like, egg whites with the, with the yolk, but... No, that is the chicken... <laughs> is it quesadilla? This looks like a chicken noodle soup, Mewtwo, but... Okay, it's a case And finally, the aforementioned Sosa yeah. from SoCal. Mm -hmm. He is widely considered to be one of the top three Project M players of all time. Now, Damn, of all time? He went up that much? Pink Fresh clears. For Team IHOP, they consisted of Neon, one of the best players in the world in early PM. Wait, I thought Neon... Is that... Is that Lucas Neon? For a long time, the most viewed... Uh, That's him? For a long time, the most viewed Smash set in history was this guy against Mewtwo King. For a long time, it was huge. But then I got overtaken. What is it now? <laughs> Would you like to know? <laughs> Are you curious? This one. And guess who commentated it? I actually, I, I, I hate going back and watching this set. I've said it before. I hate watching this set because it taught me a very important lesson about commentary. Um, because if you watch the whole tournament, like... The, the the vibe in you hate seeing Leo win. That's what many people thought. No, the vibe in the room in Evo, Leo was coming into top eight at seventh, right? But you still knew he was going to win. Like, you knew he was going to win, despite being at seventh. So the vibe the entire top eight was, holy fuck, Leo's dominating everybody. He was just like a force of nature. I said in the video, he's like a hurricane. That's just, like, you cannot stop him. He's beating everybody. So when this set happens, Tweak is the only person that really put up a fight against him. And so we're, like, hyping Tweak up. Can he beat Leo? Can he stop the unstoppable force? But if you watch it on its own without the rest of the top eight, it sounds like we are massively rooting for Tweak. Like, we are Omega Tweak biased. So, if you watch the whole top eight, it makes sense, because it's like, Leo is this unstoppable force. He's destroying everybody. But if you watch just this set, it's like, what the fuck are these guys' problem with Leo? Why do they hate Leo so much? And people rightly were annoyed at the commentary here. I get it. And I don't, I, it, I'm kind of weird about it, too, because I'm like, damn, that sucks. One of the biggest Smash sets of all time, and I feel like we didn't give Leo his props. We tried to. At least I tried to. But, you know, it's, it's one of those lessons you have to learn firsthand. I thought it would be... Well, I'm not mentioning the other bit about it, you know. People need context. Yeah, but it's not their fault. If a viewer just wants to watch Grand Finals, which most people do, you know, they, they just click on this. They don't want to see the whole thing. So, I can't find Neo Mew, Neon Mewtwo King. <laughs> Did that get wiped? 
Is that not around anymore? Oh, no, it's here. Oh, <gasps> it's only 58K? This isn't it, is it? Did it get wiped in the in the purge? That's it? It's a re-upload. Okay. So this is the set. It originally had 500,000, 600,000, something like that. The purge? Yeah. Back when the PM shit happened, when all the PM stuff happened, uh, all of the PM VODs got moved somewhere else, and we were told they were going to get re-uploaded. This is all the PM VODs off VG Bootcamp. And they are mysteriously still unavailable. Which pisses me off, because my set with Armada is still on the fucking site. Why didn't this get nuked? My three-minute set with the best player in the world. Can this please get wiped off, off the internet? Copyright strike it. I might I might call up Reggie about this. I'm going to get Tourney Locator disbarred. Can we watch it? No, I don't have the time. <laughs> we don't have the time. Listen, we've got a tight schedule here on this stream, guys. We can't watch it. No. <laughs> this set was a fucking tragedy. I was like, I've never fought Pit before. How bad could it be? <laughs> Pretty bad. Pretty fucking bad, actually. Very bad. Early PM. The aforementioned I Punch Kids. Best Lucario player in the world. I think I Punch Kids became a speedrunner in something. I don't know. Hey, by the way, ads in five seconds. Hate to tell you. Drop a Twitch Prime if you don't want ads or a tier one subscription. It's free or not. Your choice. I hope you like the ads. Send them to the ad dimension. Mods, give them the ads. Give them eight ads. Thank you, M1KH4, Mike, Mika, Mika, and Shocky Berry. Thank you. Can we watch the set during ads? No. I don't have the time. I just can't. I simply can't. Chip, AZ's best Kirby player. Oh, LOL. Kirby. Kitten, the best Ice Climbers player in AZ. Cutmet, I Hop's team captain. Master Tactician and Top Wario player in AZ. Master Tactician. Nate Senpai, the best Ness in AZ and Top Wario player. So Kirby, they couldn't do anything with his costume, right? It's just blue and white. They have nothing on that. Kitten. What's on their head? Pancakes? Those French toast? Kirby could have been an ice cube? <laughs> no. I like the hats, little communist hats, the little Russian, you know. It's French toast, right? That looks tasty. Mm. I do love French the toast. The best ice climbers player in AZ. Cutmet, I helps team captain. Wario, turn around. Master tactician and top Wario player in AZ. What's on his back? I wonder. Nate Senpai, the best <laughs> Waiter, Ness in AZ. Ness, yep, yep. And finally, Silly Kyle, the definition of a hidden boss. I didn't know Silly Kyle played PM. Huh. Silly Kyle was a, um, maybe not a top peach player in Brawl, but he was, uh, probably, like, B tier. If it's, like, A tier is the top, he's probably a B tier Brawl player. I didn't know that. All these people are MDVA scene? No, this is Arizona. MDVA would have cleared Arizona, I fear. We were so much better. Actually, no, this was after we all quit. But if we all played when we were in our primes, we would have shit on them. So, you know. Me, Boss, June, Seagull, Pink beats everybody. That's it. It's over. Put Rishi in there. Maybe Lod. It's done. Clear. What all wiped. We were nice. Yes, me. I was good. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? I was nice. And now I'm Diamond and Street Fighter. Don't be talking shit. I'm good now. <laughs> Diamond is the top 3% of players, just so you know. So, you know. Considered AZ's best player, but was unranked at the time of the crew battle. The definition... I don't like Peach with lipstick. Take that off. I don't know why I don't like that. It's too... Is it some... Why don't... I don't like it. ...of a hidden boss. 
Considered AZ's <laughs> best player, but was unranked like the at the time of the crew battle. She mm. has lipstick. A pink lipstick is fine. That's too ruby red. Uh. Due to inactivity. And one of my personal favorite plot twists about all of this was the fact that Neon from Team IHOP and Cobra from Team Denny's were actually brothers who both saw it as their duty to eliminate the other. They are not brothers. Those These dudes are twins. Their asses are not brothers. Those are identical twins. Look at those dudes. With Cobra outright saying... Before, Damn, he said, were brothers? <laughs> not after this battle. For the crew battle. This shit like a civil on. war. He's my blood. He's my responsibility. Now that everything was final... The Zucklings? <laughs> Kind of, a little bit. We set for the crew battle. On June 4th, 2016, the crew battle began. Both teams started out with 28 stocks total, giving they every sure player did. four stocks each. Denny's opened with Jesus as their lead, with IHOP choosing to lead with Chip. The crew battle immediately was very reminiscent of something you would see back in the early grassroots era of Smash. With massive hype, trash talk, and chaotic commentary, with there always being one Team IHOP and one Team Denny's member on the mic at all times. Uh -huh. You guys said in Chip first? Why wouldn't we send in this Chip This matchup first? is canonically in like... What the fuck do you mean it's canonically impossible? Kirby Dude. beats the shit out of King DDD. Yeah, not in the anime though. Dude, King DDD King is a successful King. person. What the he's hell? No, he's not. King. Dude, he... King it's all the dude on the monitor, dude. All the IHOPs in the world and close them down. Turn them he... He's he is successful technically. That's, That's true. A terrible fucking business plot. The choice to lead with Chip. Not to like take over the world, but he's successful in being a king. He has subjects. You guys are like capitalists. You think he should just always grow all the time? No, he's he's doing pretty well. Backfired. He has so much money and so much food. Chip struggled massively to get into damage. Beat his ass! Yeah! Chip out with Let's go! Huge range Kill him! It also didn't help that both players had an extremely hard time edge guarding each other. DDD which kill meant his Chip ass. was unable to gimp his. Hit him with that big ass mallet. Damn, this is fucking free. Let's go. Nope, nope, nope. Finally, Jesus ended up clutching the final stop. Kill him! To leave Team Denny's up two stops. Douche! <laughs> oh, how foolish. Back air? <laughs> what are you back airing for? There's nobody over there. IHOP cells are seething. There's nobody over there. Well, well, well. Oh, <laughs> Hold on. He turned into a rock, was but he wasn't a rock? <laughs> what the hell is that? What is that? I can't see it. That's Denny? No, he's IHOP. Well, to gimp his PM modders when they insert a random inside joke. Oh, they love that. They truly do. Oops. They love random inside Damn, jokes. Let's go. Zeus ended up clutching the f Yeah, kill his ass. Denny's has clutch. Oh. I helped then chose to send in... Damn, GR Smash has got some editing going on. I punched kids. Wait. Who had an extremely favorable going matchup a little crazy. on Zeus. And it worked out perfectly on the first stock. Oh, I hate PM Lucario, dude. PM Lucario is However, so fucked up. on the up. second stock, I Punch Kids made a huge error. This character is foolish. with an F Smash from Jesus. Die! Hey, let's go! Dropping hammer like Denny's drops prices. Let's go. What the fuck? But he managed to so, bounce back. And that could have been trash talk for both teams. And take Jesus' next stock almost unscathed. Oh, let's go! Take Jesus' next okay. stock almost unscathed. So just to be clear, Lucario's side B kills the heaviest character in the game at 102. So just so we're all on the same page. Cool, man. Lucario was one of the, like, PM was full of so many characters that the devs wanted to be good. Would it be so cool if Goku was really strong and in the game and he could chain any of his moves together? Wouldn't that be so awesome? Oh, let's go! What if Lucas could store the power and use it on a smash attack and it would kill you at 50? Just like the real power that he exhibits in the game Mother 3. I cried. I love that game. Did you play Mother 3? You should play Mother 3. I love Lucas. Denny's then sent in Cloud. What if Ganon fly? <laughs> which proved to be an extremely good choice. As he was Why are you always so mad? I lived through this. You didn't. Incredibly difficult for iPunch Kids. Wouldn't it be cool if we had fun? No! 
Because I don't get to have fun. Deal with. I have to fight Starting that. With a massive turnaround gimp on his first stock. Oh, shit. Let's fucking go. Oh, oh, damn. <laughs> oh, I can't believe they didn't go the extra mile. They got to turn the water into Oreo milkshake. I can't believe they didn't do that. And dominating the entire game without much issue. Fucking David, the pussy. He's afraid to go in. Let's go. Ooh. Oh, shit. That yeah, Squirtle's kind of messed up, too. Watch issue. this. So okay, he can wave bounce and lock you in shield with water and then grab you. And also, he has a throw that kills you at 102. <laughs> oh, never mind. I'm sorry. It's a kill setup. He, he forward throws into up smash. Oh, shit. Yeah. I think that's a DI thing. I think that's a DI thing. He managed to but... finish off Eye Punch Kids' last stock at 0% with two stocks still remaining. Who the fuck? Oh, shit. It happened. What move is that? I know it's the start of side B, but why Why is that a move? Hiya! He just Koopa shells him. That's hold side B? That's dumb. Oh shit! It, ha it happened again! I'll fucking it luck. happened again! I'll fucking luck. I, helped in I actually don't senpai. know who wins this, so I'm, I'm kind terrible. of locked in. He started off by getting killed into a BM taunt by Cloud. Forward throw up smash. Yep, there it is again. But succeeded at getting a kill into a taunt back immediately. It's basically rest. Okay. <laughs> okay, that that I am glad they added that. Immediately as revenge. The nest taunt is tremendous. The fuzzy pickles is so good. That's a really good taunt. Nate Senpai had an opportunity to close the game out with an edge guard right after. Yo. But he missed it, which he would go on to massively regret as Cloud proceeded to take his second stock. With up smash. Wow. Shocker. And Big move. An absolutely filthy footstool gimp on his next one. Oh. Coney, every time I watch a video, you watch it the next day. It's scary. Well, this came out yesterday, right? Two days ago. I mean, there's only two days I could have watched it, right? I mean, the odds are pretty high. <laughs> you know? Holy shit. <laughs> oh my Poor God. Ness. Poor Ness, bro. Holy shit. That Did was you guys see this? Why is Squirtle wave dash like that? <laughs> oh, boy. You guys haven't seen PM Squirtle. Uh, so, PM had this... PM took a lot of uh, creative liberties with characters, and they would do things that um, expanded the scope of what was possible in a platform fighter. Uh, detractors would call them gimmicks. Most players hated PM because they were gimmicks. There were so many gimmicks in the game, and Squirtle was like the biggest one because he could like slide around on water constantly. PM Squirtle felt invincible. Yeah, I hated him. I fought the other big Squirtle, Dirt Boy, at a Smash and Splash once, and I'm like, dude, what is this? <laughs> I think I... I don't know if I beat him. I... I no, I, I... We only played once. I beat a different Squirtle that was good. Um, but him and I played once, and I'm like, what is this character doing? He's nonsense. Um, and there were, like, eight characters that did that. <laughs> Crazy. Nate Senpai was at massive risk of losing all of his eight is actually a small number. What is this? Oh, it's the it's the picture coming out of the texture. I thought that was like a chicken wing. I thought this was like food coming out of the the stage is actually made of of chicken wings or breadsticks. I thought, mm. His stocks to cloud, but he managed to clutch the last stock situation to redeem himself somewhat. Oh, Ooh, situation. He's trying, just trying to make it interesting. He's just trying to make it interesting. Denny's then sent in Softy. All right, let's go. Ow! Who got completely bodied on the first stock? There it is. All right, easy all right, money, all right, easy all right. money. It was weird how all the good melee characters were just melee again, but all the brawl characters were gimmick fiends. <laughs> Well, that's because the melee players wanted just Fox again. Like, they just wanted to play Falco or Fox in a new engine. But all the Brawl characters were like, actually, Wario kind of sucks. I'm going to make him different. And then they made him the coolest character you've ever seen. And almost lost his second one. Project M seems so cool. It is. It's very fun. It's extremely fun. There we go. There we go. Here we go. 
but managed to maintain his composure and clutch out Nate Senpai's final stock, only losing one of his own. Are you even in the Wolf wasn't I'm really saying, a gimmick, no was he? Cat. Let's go, Ryan! Is Rob in Project M? Don't... I think you're trying to stunlock me. <laughs> I think, and I'm not gonna fall for it. No, Rob is not in PM. He's not in the game. Rob is not in the game. But if he was, I bet he would have a move where he goes back and forth with blasters and always dives in with forward air. I bet that's what he would do. And if he did that and was played by the biggest geeks on the fucking planet, I would get really annoyed by that. If Rob had a move that he just blasted back and forth and he would always dash away and then dash back in in forward air and these fucking dorks kept picking Rob and it was always the biggest nerd you've ever seen in your life. Every Rob player is like six foot eight with glasses and too much hair. That's Rob players. That's, theoretically, that's what would happen if he was in PM. Hypothetically. Softy then got counterpicked extremely hard. I think you're just talking about Oracle. <laughs> no, Oracle was cool. I liked Oracle. Every Rob player was, like, too tall and lanky. Every Rob player did, d just, like, was disproportionate. You know what I mean? Slenderman vibes. Hard when Team IHOP sent in Kitten. Kitten completely controlled the entire game. Yo, it's back Short season, man. Syndrome. Shut up. I'm pretty sure all Wario players are under 5'9". <laughs> I think all Wario players were 5'9 or under, so I get it. In PM. I think Sosa was pretty short, if I'm not wrong. Yeah. Taking two of Softy's stuff when Team IHOP sent in Kitten. Kitten completely controlled the entire game. Yo, it's back season, my man! Taking two of Softy's stuff. Yo, it's back season, my man! What the fuck is that? She got a visible weapon? Huh? <laughs> what is that thing? Hammer and sickle. Oh, that's kind of... I don't... Never mind. That's not cool. I thought that was kind of cool at first. Because... But I would... I, like, that would kill you. If she put that shit into your back. Hey, Connie. Right? Let's just stare at the title screen of the wild. What? <laughs> oh, I see. We're doing a mice and men thing. I see. <laughs> okay. Put it up on that. Turn around. Tell me about the tourneys, George. Taking two of Softy's stocks while only losing one of his own. <laughs> Half the cast has swords and you're concerned about a farming tool. Yeah, but that's different, right? Like, sickles feel visceral, like a horror movie thing, as opposed to a sword, which is, like, honorable. Finally ending up with a high percent softy on his last stock versus Kitten with just his Sopo, which Kitten managed to clutch out. <laughs> Shit. And then he sent in Cobra and... Kill Why? Dude, Falcon against Ice Climbers? Counterpick Kitten's That sounds climb. awful. But this appeared to backfire horribly right Yeah. Now as Kitten immediately zero to death comboed Cobra. Dude, Ice Climber's uh, Falcon is bad, right? Maybe not in Melee, but in this game, I don't think it's good, right? Falcon fucks Ices in Melee? I would think so, but in this game? I feel like Ice Climbers have, like, different shit in this game. Like, they have way more handoffs and pass-offs and bullshit. And looked as though he was going to get another one right away. But in Melee, Falcon wins, yeah. Okay. Yeah, they have better Nana AI. Which, thankfully yeah. for Team Denny's, he ended up dropping. Cobra bounced back and took Kitten's next knock after isolating him to his Sopo. Yep, the he sure did. Stocks, but the game ended unexpectedly when Kitten sadly SD'd his last stock. Hell yeah! Die! Kill him! Yo, hit him in the <laughs> Shit. This nice side beat, dumbass! <laughs> IHOP cells just can't perform. Oh, he choked. That's so tough. What a horrible fucking choice. <laughs> what choice? What a horrible choice. By the way, I don't think Popo should go that high to begin with. Like, the fact that he almost made it back with side B. Oh, shit. He shouldn't have gone that high. They weren't even connected. They didn't even do the synced one. This, this is ridiculous. This fucker sucks. Jesus Christ. What a horrible fucking choice. The next pick was obvious. IHOP sent in Neon. That's the the brothers would punch. finally have a crack at each other. 
Cobra completely bodied Neon right off the bat, taking Neon's he first sure stock did. in the first 20 seconds. He sure did. He's yep, gonna I know he did. He's going to fucking by the time this is fucking over. Oh, because it's his brother. I get it. I know. It makes sense. It makes sense. I'll, I get it. It's a little weird, but it was 2016, guys. It was it was 2016. Oh, there we go, They're brothers. Cobra. That's there still we weird. Yeah, it's 2016. I... Take another. I was fucking luck. Honestly, I, I think that's GR Smash's fault for putting that in there. He should have he should have cut that out. That was all fucking fucking luck. And then take that it. that would have killed in 2016. They thought that was really funny back then. His next one soon after. Coney, were you cool in 2016? I think I was. Well, no. <laughs> Neon managed to redeem himself, though. I don't remember what I was doing in 2016. I don't remember. Taking Cobras. Was that a league? That was league time, right? I think I was a league guy. Yeah. You went viral for the SmashCon Ryu tie clip. Oh, that was after. There was a period of time in before PM, I think. Okay, it was after Brawl, but before PM. Where I was in a deep depression for years, and I spent my my time boosting league accounts and making no money and being very sad. But that was before PM. PM and everything after has been great, <laughs> but that time in my life where I got on league, oh, it was bad. Final two stocks back to back. Oh, you guys don't know the face and gen. They know the face and genitals clip, right? Can you explain what Esam is talking about? Have you got? Do you guys not know about that? <laughs> the Diddy Kong clip. Yeah. I was talking on commentary. I'll make this quick. I was talking about on commentary how chimpanzees notably rip off your face and genitals when they attack you because they're psychopathic. Chimpanzees are fucked up and they remove what's important to you, right? And I said that Diddy might have a problem with Fox because Fox famously has metal legs, in case you guys don't know. In Star Fox, they amputate their legs and make metal ones for them so they don't lose their legs in the G-forces. For real. That's a real Star Fox thing. They have fake metal legs. That's why their up smashes are strong. Did you guys not know that? Not a joke. <laughs> Thank you, big-ass gorilla. Why the five now? Thank you for the five gifties. He has metal legs. I guess you can't really see it. Could you see it in Melee? No? Huh. You just have to trust me on this. It's it's actual lore. Legs? <laughs> this might get weird. <laughs> it got weird. It got really weird. It got weird fast. I was right. Oh my god. <laughs> I didn't think it would go I didn't think it would ramp up so quickly. Anyway, they have metal legs. Here, you can see it in Fox. See his legs? Those are metal. See his calves? You think those are boots? They're not. They have metal legs. And I was saying that uh, Falco or, or Diddy wouldn't be able to rip off Fox's, you know, stuff. Because it's metal. You know what I'm saying? Probably got amputated. Let's fucking go. Leaving the brothers even with two stocks taken off of each other each. Danny's then sent in Sosa, who lost his first stock after a failed recovery. Oh, the tank! Fucking oh shit! Yeah. Wario is so bad. Yeah. That's okay. Wario That's is okay. so bad, but dude. back and ended up taking this both of Neon's sucks. remaining stocks without much issue. Oh, here it comes. Oh, he couldn't hold it! All that fucking Denny is the indigestion! I know he was saving that all day. I, I know. He had that in his back pocket the entire night. He was like, as soon as Sosa comes up, he was holding. He was ready for that. That was locked and loaded. He was absolutely ready for that bit. Oh, hey. I know he was. It was all fucking locked. What? I hope we're now down to two players, Cutmet <laughs> and Silly Kyle. They often descend in Cutmet for the Wario Ditto. Cutmet is known for being an extremely calm player in high stress situations, so they opted to send him in for the toughest Thanks, player in Cameroon. the Thanks, Cameroon! After struggling for the first stock, he managed to take Sosa's stock right back. Uh, 
Sosa answered by taking Cutmet's third stock. Oh, yeah, he did. Sneaky back here. But immediately SD'd right after, leaving him to his final <laughs> stock. Oh. Yeah! Come on, dude! I need some charity a little once in a while. Sosa continued racking up damage and looked poised to take Cutmet's next stock before Cutmet caught a massively off guard with a down B to eliminate Sosa entirely. Oh, let's go! <laughs> that angle was nonsense. Down B to eliminate. Look at this so angle. Sad. Oh no, he's gonna do it. <laughs> he died on the ground. Oh! <laughs> he doesn't react for all this time. Yeah, dude, he is, he's just, hold on, I'm in the way. I need you to, look at how long he's drifting. So continued that shit up smelled so bad. To take Cutmet's next stock before he got Omega stunned. Off guard with a down B to eliminate so so entirely. <laughs> Watch this. Entirely. Oh! <laughs> he jumps here. He's almost off the screen. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, let's go. He jumps away. It's yeah! not that bad. That's that's, that's this tough. This was a huge upset. Denny's were now down to Casino Wolf and Isla Bay. I assume this comes down to the last stock. It has to. So they opted to send in Isla It has Vegas. to come down to the end. Take out Cutmet's first stock at high percent. There we go, Surely. Go. And racked up a ton of damage to Cutmet's next one before he was finally finished off. Yeah. Making it extremely easy for him to take Cutmet's final stock with a sure you can. There we go! That's not what that move is called. I hope we're now down to just their anchor, Silly Kyle. Yeah, so this is over, right? Silly Kyle came in and absolutely. What the fuck is Luigi doing? Dude, it's weird to me that people haven't seen pre like Ultimate or Smash 4 Luigi. Wolf and I love bagels. I love so old they Luigi. Descend in I love bagels. He managed to take old Luigi is so slippery. At Look at him go. <laughs> I secondary Luigi in PM. I loved him. He's so funny. And racked up a ton of damage to come its next one before he was finally He just off. slides. Yeah! Making it extremely easy for him to take Cutmet's final stock with a sure you can. There we go! I love him. I hope we're now down to just And now you hate Luigi. I sure do. They made him so much worse, dude. Luigi's just annoying now. Their anchor, Silly Kyle. Gen 4 Luigi. Silly Kyle came in and absolutely dominated Isle of Bagels, constantly forcing him off stage and into bad okay, position. Okay, well he has D while there. barely taking any damage himself. Oh, she has a frying pan. Oh! Like I hop. I get that. Both players ended sure. up at high percents with bagels on his last stock and Kyle with three stocks remaining. But Kyle managed to clutch it out. You know, I feel like the commentary is kind of spoiling it, you know? I, I, okay. Grappler Luigi was an awful idea. I don't know why they didn't just make him weird Mario. I don't know why they turned him into a grappler. That's so weird for him. That's, I, uh. So this was it. With only why do that? Wolf remaining for Team Denny's. Both teams were down to their last player. Team Denny said specifically saved Casino Wolf to counter Silly Kyle. As the last time they had played, Casino Wolf Damn! and Silly Kyle 3 0. Zap him! This single match was going to be the final decider of which restaurant was better. Thanks for the tier one, Nick. Thanks for the gifty. IHOP or Denny's. Kyle started the game off with some Armada level turnip luck, pulling a beam sword. Oh, they have beam swords? The Empire Strikes Back! Which made 303 great use of into a stitch face, which missed. He got a fucking stitch right after, uh -huh. dude. The, the breakfast gods want fucking Silly Kyle to win. Into a Mr. Saturn. Damn. A casual 1 in 5.3 million chance. Despite this, the two players were both evenly matched, with them trading the first stocks of the game. Nick, I'm not doing this. <laughs> I'm not thanking you every time. Just gift 10 right now so I could just do it all in one. Yeah. Now 
Yeah! Kyle then pulled another <laughs> stitch, which landed. I don't know how to gift like three. What you, Nick? Nick, you can only gift one at a time. You know what? Yeah, I'm fine with those two. Thank you very much. I'm okay with the two gifts. I do appreciate it. Thank you. It means a lot to me. Thank you, Nick. <laughs> he keeps giving one. <laughs> Thank you for that. I appreciate it. Oh! <laughs> Cena will barely survive it. Cena will survivability He's was not insane. Even this himself, yeah. Him almost dying and surviving. <laughs> yeah, I'm not plus doing time. it. I'm not doing it. That's enough. But Kyle Event was insane this stock, <laughs> with him almost dying and surviving five plus times. But Kyle eventually did manage to take his next stock. <laughs> Yell it out! So then managed to come back and take Kyle's second last stock after taking a bit of damage, leaving Kyle and Team IHOP to their final stock. Yeah! Stop! Stop! Don't do this! Don't do this. Don't make this a regular thing. Don't do that. It was incredibly I'm not doing it constantly. Close. With both players playing extremely patient. <laughs> the Casino Wolf managed to rack up some damage on Kyle. Thank Kyle you. We for Evie. Thank you. So, so this was it. Thanks, with both Nick. players on their final stock, everything was on the line. <laughs> Alright, Silly Kyle with a quick narrow out of shield. It is last Thank stock, you. Denny's versus IHOP. Silly Kyle at 87%. Casino Wolf on a press stock. Let's see how it's up. Oh shit. Hold on, I've been playing this whole thing to watch this ending. Dude, he's the fucking kid. He doesn't die here though, right? This kid up. Dude. You're fucking kidding me. We lost how many stocks to a peach? He'll show. So it's all peach. It's just this fucking guy. It's just silly Kyle wiping the entire Denny squad. That's this, huh? Why not just go to Waffle House? I don't have any. There are no Waffle Houses near me. Everybody says that. Oh, dude, just go to Waffle House. There's nothing near me. I have two Denny's and two IHOPs near me. Thank you, why you, why. I just realized your name is why you, why, why you. I thought it was Wahoo. Why you. Why you, why you. I never noticed that. This is just like Saxima Fumpet. I thought it was Saxima Puppet forever, but it's Fumpet. That was crazy. Unfortunately, I have win. Haven't you done this before? Probably. <laughs> Fuck. I'm leaving. After I hop's triumphant victory, Everyone headed to the nearest Waffle Houses only pop up in disaster prone areas. <laughs> like like blight in a video game. It's like the like the bad shit in Sunshine. You have to clean it up like Mario with the <laughs> first I hop for the obligatory celebratory meal. With every Denny's player forced to come along. Depending on who you ask, this was either the worst. It took me forty five minutes to get a glass of water and an hour for me to get my food. All I got was an appetizer I split with Cloudburst. It was cold, and like all hey hop food, it forced stocked my stomach. So this could have been said about either of them. I will say, as much as I like Denny's, like this happens everywhere. That shit could take an hour no matter where you go. You're just rolling the dice. Worst meal of their life or the greatest? <laughs> Congratulations! <laughs> this was either the worst meal of their life or the greatest. <laughs> he did not. No, he didn't. I know he didn't do that. By the way, this is the same guy that said the other guy got food poisoning at Denny's. I'm starting not to believe anything, he says. Greatest. Congratulations! <laughs> they made a cake. Denny serves pancakes too, man! I hope! I just realized Habitful gifted 12 months of a sub. <laughs> Why did you do that? They might not even be here in a year. 
Instead of 12 subs, you gifted 12 months of a sub. You locked someone in. You gave them a prison sentence. You're here for a year. Well, Soonstone, I hope you enjoy the Coney stream. <laughs> One year of Coney viewing on the house. Yeah. Congrats. The iconic habit for years. Oh, wait, that's the end? Oh, it just ends there. Dude, whatever. What? Ooh. Oh, that's another GR Smash video. See, he almost got me to click. Look at that right there. You see it? Good movie. I'm happy that GR Smash is trying some different shit. He used to just put out, like, just straight compilations. Like, no context in between. Just, like, yeah. Just, just single clips, right? Oh, my God. Apex 2015. Curse tournament. Where was it? I just saw it. What if it's not in the video? This video, it's, it's just haunted. It was this one. Wait! Oh, this is the moment I told you guys about! Oh my god! <laughs> Remember this? This was the, uh, this is that story I told you. Thank you, Urban Line. Thank you, Known Relic. Uh, this is Emu Killer, uh, talking shit to me. Watch him here, alright? Because I'm in the crowd talking shit to Emu Killer, alright? I'm literally right here talking shit because it's Marcus against him. So watch this. Nice stuff right there. Oh, wow. He's looking at me. <laughs> He's looking at me. I'm standing right over here talking so much shit. And he gets the other. He's like, what, bro? What's up? What's up? What, what do you want? Yeah, okay, bro. Yeah. And then... My goodness. He popped off a little bit. I thought I was like, does he know it's over? But it's not over at all. And now Pink Fresh like, you trying to pop off on me? Um. Oh, my God. Well, well, well. Oh, my God. Distraction complete. <laughs> I got his mind out of the game. What can I say? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Some people might might attribute this win to, to Pink Fresh, but I think there was more at play, right? <laughs> you know Coney is over there going, woo. I, I don't know if... I, I think I had to have been popping off, but I don't know. I assume I'm talking a lot of shit right here. <laughs> He's shaking his hands. all of that <laughs> it was a fun time he shit on me in singles by the way <laughs> he dumpstered me in singles emu killer like it was not dude mewtwo in this game is a war crime doesn't he hate you now i don't think so i if he does i i don't know what what i did but i love emu killer he is funny as shit emu killer is a hilarious guy he's a great guy I hope he doesn't hate me. I'd be sad if he hated me. <laughs> you know what's weird? Seeing old HBox. That's so weird. <laughs> HBox had like 300, 400 subs for a long time. It's cursed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A long time. And then he blew the fuck up. Why isn't he screaming? He hadn't unlocked that yet. He hadn't found that part of himself. It'll come. Actually, he might scream here. Wait. Oh, my God. <laughs> There's your answer. There you go. Oh, he died. <laughs> I didn't notice that. I forgot about that. I never realized there's only 14 seconds left here. Jesus Christ. 14 seconds left in a two-stock game. That sucks. Star KOs were so fucking stupid. <laughs> I'm glad we mostly got rid of them now. I think they still happen right, like pretty often, but they're kind of fun. They are funny. I do like that. How did we ever play Smash 4? I don't remember it. I legitimately don't remember anything about Smash 4. It was like I got my, my brain wiped. It's weird. HBox is definitely an IHOP guy. We can find out. No way he donor walls me, right? 
Oh, this is that. an intense I've set. I've never lived that in my life. Down, so down. It's an intense set. He's gonna dono wall me. It's 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 Jigglypuff Ganon. <laughs> I'll ask him another time. Good movie. Pretty good. It was nice. I like that GR Smash is pivoting into some other stuff. That was pretty good. I'll ask him now. No, he's in the middle of a set. Bro, he's working. He's at his job. Coney, opinions on Bob Evans. You know my opinions on Bob Evans. Check this out. <laughs> I love this thing. I love that. I love the burrowing snaggerit death sound. Play it at a slower speed. That shit's haunted. Didn't you get wiped by the third one? Dude, I couldn't believe there were three. Two is a lot. Bet you won't do a Twitter poll on Denny's vs. IHOP. It feels like low-hanging fruit. No, I shouldn't. I'm not going to do it. Didn't know that was an Olimar character? What, this? Yeah, if you ever see a fucked up monster that looks like it, it's like a, like a, like a real thing, but, but if it was, like, crossbred, you know? Or like a, like a cabinet of Dr. Caligari thing? Is that what it is? Or, or Dr. Mon Moreau? What's the one where he, he intersplices animals? Whatever that old movie is, that's Pikmin. That's what that does. Coney, can you explain why my ch why chat says my car no? <laughs> well, there are 1,350 people in here right now. It stands to reason that some of them are driving. Some of these people might be driving when they listen to me. And if I make a sound loud enough, their car might jump. <laughs> Like bounce in the air, right? I'm pretty sure I probably have killed someone during a stream just by doing a really loud noise that swerves them off the road. But it's all part of the... Uh, <laughs> it's the risk you take by watching Coney on Twitch. The funniest Coney loud is the Omega Analyze. I haven't done that in a while. Do you mean... Dude, people are scrambling for the mute button. Oh, I never set it back up after I reformatted. I don't have it. I don't have it. Immediately turned it down. I don't have it. Sorry. This is the best I can do. It's not the same. The buzzer was so much worse. Does anybody have a link to the buzzer? Wrong buzzer loud. Yeah, does anybody have that? <laughs> I want to see it again. I want to see if it really was that loud or if we're just exaggerating. It really, it actually scared me. <laughs> no, that's not it. Somebody <laughs> sent me a link and it was just like an MP3 file. Oh, here it is. It's not as loud in this clip, but this is the clip where it happened. All right, I'm going to turn it up to 100. Here we go. Three, two, one. Stop driving. If you're driving, pull over. If you're driving, pull over right now. <laughs> I hope you got over to the shoulder. Hope you guys are okay. Is everybody okay? I know several of you were just in accidents. Are you all, are, did you guys get over, are you guys safe? Did anyone go off a bridge? That was three times louder than I remember. I should stop. Normal streamers don't do this. I really shouldn't do this. I just, it's really funny to me. I know I shouldn't do this. This is like the opposite of what you're supposed to do as a streamer. Yeah. Viewer count dwindling as viewers die. Actually, that would help my viewership because they can't click off. If I could kill chat while they're in here, my viewers would only go up. 
There's probably, I bet there could be like an anime or a movie about that, right? A guy who streams and he kills you and he streams. So you leave the tab open and then he amasses a million views. And people are like, wow, this guy's blowing up. He has a million views. And it turns out he's killing you through the computer. This is a Germa joke. No, it's not. That's Peep the Horror. <laughs> That's not the same thing. I'm talking about somebody like a like who blows up like a Kai Sinat or I Show Speed, but he's actually killing people, right? Terrible story. I think it's pretty good. You can make a movie on that. Oh, really? So people, I'm doing a Germa bit, but now everybody says minus two. You guys are so cringe. Ew. <laughs> Wrong buzzer sounds. An hour? I don't like that. It, like, tickles my ear. What's this clip? It wasn't loud? <laughs> yeah? Alright, how about now? That's the last time. 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 I swear to God. That <laughs> I swear to God, I will not do it again. I swear to God. I will never do it again. Well, not never, but I won't do it again tonight. I swear. <laughs> um, my bad. I'm so sorry. Holy. Hit <laughs> my sinuses. Is it that deep in there? <laughs> How many gifted to watch the buzzer movie? The buzzer movie? It's less than a second. 3,700. <laughs> 3,700 to watch the buzzer movie. Oh, the hour long one? Oh my God. 10K. No. I'm not doing that. I remember the leaf blower into the mic. Dude, my 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 keyboard started messing up again today. My keyboard, I wanted to hear it again. My keyboard started messing up again today. I think it's when it's hot in here because I think so in case you guys don't know, I spilled monster in my keyboard and now sometimes when I type letters it'll Okay, it works now. It's on the left or the right side of the keyboard. Sometimes when I type letters, it'll just go like this. Right? It was bad. Um, but it only happens when it's warm. Because I think the monster is like... Melting? I think it's like... It, it hardens when it's cool in here. But when it's like warm and humid, it gets all like melty and sticky. And then it starts, like, spreading a bit. Do you get what I'm saying? Probably all the spit from licking it. I only licked it once. I licked my keyboard one time, and it worked for a little bit. Congealing. Yes, yes, exactly. Please clean your keyboard. I, th you can't clean a drink off a keyboard. I gave it a tongue bath. Yeah, <laughs> I don't like saying that. Take out your keycaps. I already did. Dude, this was, like, weeks ago. It's already done. It's done. It's fixed. It normally doesn't. It's not broken. Sometimes it does, but we're good. Drown it in water. No. <laughs> it's an expensive keyboard. It's a Keychron. All right. I, I want to do one of two things. I was going to do both, but do I? kind of want to play this Q game. <laughs> Pikmin 2? No, I'm playing this Q Remastered game, bro. I don't know anything about this game, but... Let me just turn that down. Stop. Stop. Dude, one is not quiet enough. <laughs> what the fuck? IQ test. It sure is. <laughs> I'm sorry this stream is so loud. I don't mean for it to be. I'm sorry. This is Q Remastered. Oh, no. I want to do the IQ test. It's a game where you uh, 
I actually don't know what you do. <laughs> I have not played this before. Wait, how do I get out? How do I go back to the menu? I'm restarting. We'll do the IQ test. I'll do an IQ test first. IQ test. Shall we? Use the mouse to draw shapes on the screen to complete the test. There's no limit to the number of times a figure can be drawn. However, the fewer drawings you make, the higher your rating. IQ diagnosis. Click on the IQ icon for a comprehensive diagnosis. A comprehensive diagnosis can be carried out at any time, but it's recommended that 20 of the top tasks are get completed. Okay. <laughs> Let's turn that down. I don't like that. Well... I need something. Okay. Put your drawing into the beaker. You cannot draw in the blue area. Uh. Thank you, Phil LaPhil. Can I, like... <laughs> Let's go! I did it! <laughs> 30? <laughs> no. No. No, no, no. Guys, this is just for fun and not a real IQ test. You can't have six IQ. I would be dead. You can't survive. By the way, ads in five seconds. Drop a Twitch Prime or a Tier 1. Otherwise, you're going to get some ads. Send the ads. Send the ads. Mod, send the ad dimension while I perform the IQ test. Okay. Let me go back. Make the red ball touch the red area. Hold on. I got to, like, get out of the way for this. Uh, let me get... Let me get small. Okay. Uh, can I push it? No. How do I go back? Okay. Um. Like, like this? Okay, thanks. 100 is average, by the way. Draw something and touch the red area. Um. Fuck. <laughs> uh. <laughs> what, what? How do I? How do I? Do, how, how can I? Gifted! 130! 130 IQ! That's like genius. That's actually genius level. That's good. <laughs> this song is killing me. This song is talking about Nesquik. Make the red square touch the left wall. What if I just push it? Okay, no. Um. Can I... How do I move it? <laughs> this is a Michael Jackson beat. Yeah, let's turn on uh let's turn on chat song requests. I gotta wipe it though. <laughs> this song is pissing me off. Kinda give me more now though. All right, go. Q is clear. Go, go, go. Okay. 
Okay. Dave, you got that quick. How do you make... How do I move the red square? Like, I don't know how to move it. What if I keep adding more pressure? Go. Dude, what? How do I move that? I don't know what to do. Maybe, like, bigger means more power. Yeah, here we go. Go. <laughs> oh, no. How the fuck do you move it? A big rock. Yeah. Like, how heavy is this square? Dude, are. <laughs> how do I move this? I got an idea. I got an idea. No. Okay. <laughs> Make this. And then we're gonna put this up, right? And then here it comes. Hold on. And go! Yo! 90? Yeah, that was pretty good. I figured it out. That was nice. Okay, make the ball touch the red area. Uh. Okay. If this like goes like this, and then it's like a cup. Like, oh, I forgot that could. Let's go back. Okay. Uh, like this. Uh. Okay. And go! Oh, it's on rollers? Oh, what the fuck? I didn't realize those were rollers. Go. Dude, are you... Okay, never mind. I didn't know those would roll. What are you doing? I'm making the red ball touch the red area. <laughs> okay, hold on. We're going to give it some speed. Go. Go. If I can get it, if I can get it to like get speed. It'll launch. Go. <laughs> Wait. Okay. No. <laughs> I was like really excited. I thought that'd be good. Build a bridge? You can't! Wait. No, hold on. <laughs> no. 
Now what? <laughs> Good idea, Coney. Thank you. Uh, now, how do I get that? Send it? Send what? What do you mean, send it? Where? What do I send and where? Here we go! I don't know what to do. I'm so confused. Fill the middle. <laughs> okay. Good idea, chatter. Modern problems require modern solutions. And go! Go! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is so stupid. What do you do? Make a seesaw at the bottom? That won't work. That's so dumb. What do you mean? Like this? With like this. And then like that. That doesn't work. Well, hold on. You mean like this, and then like that, and then like that. It looks so easy until you're in the game. No, push. It's going. I don't think this is gonna work. Uh huh. <laughs> it's not a seesaw. It doesn't do that. That doesn't work. Semicircle? That's so smart. Why didn't I think of that? You guys gotta understand, anything I draw falls. So it's not... Wait. No. Hold on. Yahoo! This is the same guy who said he didn't want to play Tears of the Kingdom because he didn't want to be created. This is hard! Puzzle. Watch carefully, new viewers. This no. is the true nature of a contrarian. Also, you were very bad at this coming. Hold on. It looks easy, but it's not, I assure you. There, now we have a box. Because how do you move the ball? It's on the ground. Oh my god. Wait. It's in. 130. 130. Dude! Seriously. I'm pretty good. Draw something and touch the red area. Okay. Um. Uh oh. <laughs> I didn't think this through. <laughs> I thought I could do something on top. Uh huh. All right. Here's what we do. Here's what I know what to do. I know what to do. We build a Yoop machine. E e oh my god. E you oh my god, this is making me so mad. Good idea, Cody. Why is this the only thing you're saying? I hate this guy. I hate Kindler. I hate this. <laughs> Every time I look over, it's that guy. It's that one guy giving me the same message. Hold on. It's too steep. So if I go like this. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, I have the right idea though, right? Why are you so you pilled? It's the right idea. Hold on. 
I'm gonna make a trampoline. Boing! <laughs> I thought that would go higher. I thought that would go higher. Okay, here we go. This is what we'll do. We'll do... We'll make... Okay. Like this. Yup. And then... Like... This. Right? Like that. No. Bye. Hold on. Stop. Don't do this. Hold on. Okay. Okay. I have an idea. <laughs> if I go like this, and then I, I put this there. No. You see what I'm going for, though, right? Hold on. Okay. <laughs> okay. This will work. This will work. This will work. This is research. Yahoo! This is good. This is good. This is good. This is good. Hold on. You know, Connie, watching <laughs> you do this is an yeah? amazing self-esteem boost. Thank you for letting me realize how good. much yeah. smarter I am than the average country. Yep. Fun. Hold on. Put the ball in here. Go! Launch it! Oh my god. I had the right idea, though. I had the right idea. That was the right idea. That was actually the correct idea. Good idea, Coney. That's what I'm saying! Okay. Is it moving? Okay. Here it goes. Go! Thank you. And a hundred. Dead average. That's fine with me. We got it. New questions appeared. We worked it worked out. It worked out. Have only one snowflake in the contain. easy that one was dumb <laughs> fine I'm adding that because nobody else will ever use it that's one of those things that people will be like what does that mean and they're gonna be like oh okay and I'm not gonna see it past tonight I'll never see it again after tonight Wait, it's called Coney? Oh, I didn't notice that. My chat is a disaster now. <laughs> All right, I'm I, I'm turning that off now. I have to turn it off. I didn't notice that. That that'll make it not possible. Lower the coat hanger. Um that would taste so much better with hedgehog in it. The more I can the bigger it is.
caveman streamer? This is hard. I don't know. I don't like this one. I don't get... I don't... I didn't do physics class, dude. We go trampoline here? What does that mean? What do you mean we go trampoline? Surely a ramp could fix this. Good idea. <laughs> Wait. A ramp and a big ball. Oh! Go! Oh, my God. <laughs> Go! Go! Oh, my God, dude. Oh, oh, hold on. It's really hard. All right, ramp it. Nope. Push. <laughs> now what? Send the rock? You think? Wait. Aha. A big rock. <laughs> I love big rock. I think I thought big rock would work. Uh, big rock on stick. Big rock on stick. Yeah! What the big fuck? Rock. What the fuck? What do you mean the other side? How do I push it further? There's no way to push it further. Yahoo! What are you talking about? There's a big rock emote. <laughs> okay. Okay. $10 from look at me. <laughs> <laughs> that seems a, like a very confusing chat message. That's very confusing for everyone. Dude, what do I do here? Lower the coat hanger, but how? Big rock not work. Big ramp not work. How make spin coat? Wait. <gasps> oh my god. I have to spin it all the way around. Make a roller coaster, Cody. Okay. Pretty fun. Use the tip? What do you mean, the tip? That looks fun. Thanks. We. Dude, what do I do? I actually don't shoot under it. What do you mean, shoot? Hit the other side. The other side won't work. Oh, we seesaw this, actually. Yes! Let's go! Let's... Go! Let's go! No! Fuck, I had it, dude. Okay. <laughs> yes! Oh my god. Dude, 
This is unbelievable. <laughs> this is this is so far I can't. I'm I'm losing my fucking mind. This is really pissing me off. Rock. Go. Yes, 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 yes. And go. Oh my god, I killed all my momentum. Oh my god. Pony, could you please draw a dog? This is the hard part. I forgot it's not paint. I try to make it say wolf. <laughs> that was hard. Dogs from the front are easier though, because that's just uh <laughs> Yoda, shut the fuck up. Can you guys focus on the task? Big rock. <gasps> oh my god. It's a long bit. One. It's so third notice, jury duty, third notice, mortgage bill. Ooh, second notice. Plant Crest Enterprises. Oops, <laughs> that's for me. Plant Crest Enterprises. Literally finds it. I don't know if it's the whole thing you though. Liar. You don't have a home business. Why would you make up a lie like that? No, it's true. Mon and I sell religious hook rugs over the internet. Internet, eh? Yes, indeedy. Making <laughs> some good scratch, too. Scratch, eh? Yep. Mod, eh? <laughs> and like 10 seconds later, Marsh says, Internet, eh? I don't know why it's so fu I can't find it anywhere. I can't find... <laughs> Like, everybody just keeps saying A. It's so... It's very funny in context. I promise it's very funny in context. Okay? <laughs> you should watch the show, okay? It's a good show. Wait. Wait, can you just... <laughs> what the fuck was I doing? Because then this hits that, and then it turns... Oh my god. Go. Ah! I'm losing my fucking mind. Wait. Okay, it said lower the coat hanger, so I thought maybe I could stretch it. Do it from the bottom? Hook right side of hang? Dude, this is stupid. What do you mean hook it from the bottom? What does that mean? Oh, like this. Wait.
Aha! Oh! <laughs> well, hold on! Dude. Biggest rock possible. This is killing me. Oh my god! I did. 130. It's a 130. Thank you, Verb. Thank you for, for being a man of honor. Thank you. The yellow ball will start moving when something touches it. I mean... Let's just... Oh my god, this something can't be another ball. Okay. That's dumb. No, but I get it. I get it. I get this. I mean, I could just bump it. Bump three things. I could just do three, but I'm trying to do it in as few moves as possible. I'm trying to do it in, in as few moves as possible, guys. Also, whatever chatter did this, you just you just saw the name of the game was Q, and you just did the Q. <laughs> we'll just do it this way. There, done. Everything's in. 130. 100, fine. How's my IQ looking? I haven't beaten all the levels yet. Dude, I've been 58. I'm right here. Oh my god. I haven't beaten the levels. I haven't beaten the levels. Once I throw Alex up 10 meters? Alright, here we go, Alex. Uh, good luck. Just like <laughs> <laughs> Cody's answer to everything is dropping a huge rock like it's Looney Tunes. No, it's because you how do you wait? Maybe he'll bounce. No, he died. I would, like, how do you, you need momentum. Like, how do you give him momentum? Right? Hold on. I got an idea. I have an idea, I have an idea. Here you are, Alex. No. Well? Oh, there's no ending here. Okay, hold on. I'm trying to get Alex to sit down. Like... This is based on height, not moves made. Okay. So, okay. 
Okay. No, no. He, why is he so light? Okay. Okay. I have an idea. Okay. Here you are, Alex. Have a seat. Have a seat. Sit down, Alex. Sit. I'm trying to get Alex to sit on the thing. If I could like get under his feet and put him in a in a in a box, we'd be good. Draw a hammer, not a long line. <laughs> a hammer is a rock! Seesaw plus big rock. No, but if you touch him with the seesaw... You don't understand. If you touch him with the seesaw, he jumps away. Go, Alex. This is so annoying. Okay. Here we go. Push. He fucking holds it! I gotta do this the other way. Okay, because his back is turned. Yes. Get on the seesaw, Alex. Got him. Dude, it keeps hitting the fucking other side. Don't make the thing a line, make it a rock? What do you mean? Just build him a ladder? <laughs> Here you go, buddy. I, do, I don't know how to launch it. How the fuck do you launch this? Make a box behind him. So, like, this. And then... Put a ball in his hand and he will fall forward. <laughs> Aha! I see. So you you do this, and then you. It's you motherfucker! Oh wait, no. There he goes. The problem is he when he falls forward, he doesn't go far enough. Oh, wait, I could just do that. Wait, wait, wait. Launch! He fucking kicks it. Dude, I don't understand. I don't understand. This is so annoying. Rock on stick? What do you mean, rock on stick? That's always the answer. Coney, he said it. Wait, what? Hey, die, Jack. Take those stupid sunglasses off. We're inside. How does he know about Comb Tuesday? <laughs> How does he know? They shouldn't know about that, man. There's a certain Welsh village which has become world famous simply because of its name. A What's name the name? It enables the village to boast one of the longest railway station signs in the oh world. Oh, my God. Situated on the beautiful Isle of Anglesey, it is called... This song will teach you how to say it. Wait. If I put a big rock in his hand, he might just jump. Whoa! Wait, that was it. Come on. 
Go! <laughs> okay. Go! If I hit him in the hand, he might just launch. You know what I mean? The problem is that he's so, like, not weighty. Are you ready, children? Let's teach the world. Plan by. Plan by. Put Quinge. Launch. Coney is so stupid. This is really hard. Hold on. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. That's all there is to it. So let's sing it. Plan by. Put Quinge. Go get a quill. If I can get one in his tummy. Believe me, it's easy when you know how. So I'll teach you in a song. And you will soon be saying it if you simply sing along. Ads in 10 seconds. Sub with Twitch Primer Tier 1, everybody. Thank you. Surround him in a claw? What does that look like to you? Put something in his hand. The word means St. Mary's Church in a hollow by the White Hazel, close to the Rapid Whirlpool, near the Red Quay of St. Cecilio. Rock and Psalm one stroke. I'm trying to build a If I can build this, like a little, wait, this is it. Oh my God, that's it. Yes. Oh my God. Here we go. Here we go. A little bucket for him to go in. Right? And he goes like that. Get in there. Get in. That's the answer though. That's definitely the answer though. Right? Get in, dude. How do I get him in? Shorter bucket? I think you're right. But if it's too small... It <gasps> Alex is going to space. Everyone salute Alex on his final mission. We're sending him into orbit. We pray for his safe return. Godspeed, Alex. <sighs> Thank you. <laughs> hey, I beat it. That doesn't mean zero if I beat the fucking thing. That's not a zero, actually. Here we go. I got an idea. Pull that shit off. <laughs> Pull it off. Pull it. Maybe a big rock will bounce it. Like, it'll go... <sighs> he has learned two things. Rock and hook rock. What else is there? Claw? What is a claw? Like this? P 
peel it back. Yes! Get the ball out. <gasps> That's a hook. What's a claw? Are hooks and claws are the same thing. What do you mean? What are you talking? Draw it right now. Draw it just like Verb did. Claw is a double hook. What, like this? <laughs> All right, smart guy, now what? Now attach rock. <laughs> like this? <laughs> you guys are so annoying. Barb Raiders, you guys are so much smarter than my check. Can you guys help me out? How do I get this, bu this ball the fuck out of here? Does anyone know? My chat's too stupid to do it. We can't figure it to get out. Wait. See? <laughs> Small lines? My chat is so dumb. We've all been doing this together, and it takes them so long. They're so dumb, dude. They're so stupid. Longer claw. What are you talking about? I voted for you to fail, but I nevertheless have an idea. Yeah? Go grab from one wall to the side of the thing, then drop a rock in the wall. <laughs> okay, yeah. All right, make a ramp from one wall to the side. What, like like this, you think? Like this. This, what you think, smart guy? And then the rock, huh? Hmm, that's what you think, huh? <laughs> Good idea, Coney. That wasn't my idea! <laughs> I didn't do that! Oh, here we go. Wait, wait, wait. Big Ball's gonna knock it over. Here we go. Here comes Sonic. You... I'm, I'm fucking angry. Hold on. Maybe if I peel it like this? No. If I do, like, a big... Push the set. Barb Raiders, this game is so much harder than it looked. Okay, Raiders? <laughs> I'm sorry that you had to see it. This is so hard. If a Barb Raider can figure this out, I will give 10 subs right now. I will reward you. Don't copium me. What the fuck? Why are the Raiders copiuming me? You guys are assholes. Be nice. You need to rest the ramp on something you need to go. Try a big penis. I tried that. <laughs> I've done I've already done that a few times. Oh, bigger. Okay. <laughs> like this? Now it looks like I have a medical issue. <laughs> and it, or or uh, I'm potent, I guess. I don't I gotta. Ew, Squidward House! <laughs> Squidward's house! <laughs> this is the miracle of life. There it is. That's the baby right there. <laughs> Give it a hat? Dude, this shit is hard. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Drop a seven, but the bottom line is not slanted on the si right side of it. Like a... Like a this? You are so dumb. Oh, people are now sending discords. Okay. All right, chatter. You got it. All right, here we go. We're going to take this, and we're going to put it into action, okay? All right. Now, keep in mind, this is literally what that chatter made. What I think you are failing to realize, chatter, is that there's gravity. I don't think you can do it. I get that you want to hug it here, like this. Like that, right? That's what you want. So it sticks, right? That's what you want. But it doesn't. 
Chatter, I think you are woefully mistaken. If this works, I'm going to be so angry. Other way? What do you mean, other way? Make the other claw longer. This one? That's what you think? ECC, I would look toward you with the Congressional Needle of Honor. Look away for a second. Okay. <laughs> that's a, yeah, I think that's like a public event. You can't kill me in broad daylight, Barack Obama. Both claws bigger. Oh, I'm trying somebody else's solution. <laughs> this is the same thing. It's a, what the fuck is this? You made an afro. It's like one of those clowns with the big afro and the red nose. This is so much harder than you realize. <laughs> I like the chat participation, though. This is fun. This is good. Okay. All right. Here we go. Did any of you guys take physics classes? Because I didn't have those. Just like while we're talking about it. I didn't have physics. <laughs> this is not fun. I agree. I'm not enjoying myself. Dude, this doesn't work. Ramp with rock. Why are you guys always ramp with rocking? Thank you, Pizza Professor. We know, Connie. We can't see you, did we? Good one. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm a mechanical engineer, and watching this pains me. Drop 10 subs right now, old rich ass. Bragging about your career in chat. Oh, Mr. College over here. I'm rich, and I don't like watching this. That's what you said. Pay up. What the fuck is this? Okay, big guy. Wait, this might... <laughs> Good one. <laughs> Everybody keeps doing the clown afro strat. Everybody's doing clown afro. Okay, yeah. Like this, right? And then like this. But then it doesn't... You can't... You don't have enough room. <sighs> the rug seems pretty good here. I think we're legend. <gasps> Wait. I think I got it. It's a fucking can opener. Send it! Here we go. Dude, how the fuck do you... S IQ of 120. I told you. It's already on the ground. You lose? Uh, uh, <laughs> all right. Claws thick rock.
Wait a minute. I have an idea. <laughs> Good idea, Coney. Thank you. Wait, that's actually it. That's actually it. Hold on. No. I have it, though. I do have it. <laughs> oh I have it. It's just... Like, I know what to do. Lay it flat? No, but then it's just going to be on the... What do you mean, lay it flat? Oh, like this. <laughs> well, how do you get it in there now, smart guy? Hmm? made a martini. <laughs> Bro making a cocktail. Where'd you ramp what? Hold on. I can fix this. <laughs> Keep sending pebbles. I had something there. That almost worked. I was close. I okay. So what you have to do is put Yeah. Big rock push cup onto the thing, right? Oh my god. Go, go, go. 
I'm gonna scream. I'm gonna fucking scream. I'm gonna fucking scream. I swear to God. It's not even fun anymore. I'm just mad. Check Discord DM. Hold on. <laughs> is that what you wanted? This is your thing, right? This is your... You done made a drink. You made a delicious drink. It's another martini. Stop making drinks. Wrong shape. What are you talking about? <laughs> what the fuck is this? Okay. I'll give it a shot, chatter. Here you go. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> it didn't work. It didn't work. It didn't work. And now I'm going to ban you because you're wrong. <laughs> it didn't work. Sorry. <laughs> Wait, I think it's literally... Oh, no. Wait, if I could just... <laughs> just... Oh my god. Go. Get up. Get up. Get up! Get up. Get up. Please get up. <laughs> I'm going fucking insane. Go. <gasps> you did it. I did it. Haiti IQ? Uh, it's better than zero, which I've also gotten. I have an idea. Touch it. Oh! That was the right idea, though. Oh, beautiful. That... Wait. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. This is so hard. You guys, please, I, I just ask that you understand this is embarrassing it's really hard you guys haven't played it wait you don't know what this is like Here we go. go to the fucking moon Oh no, the other seat, the thing is going to stop. This is way harder than it looks. I'm serious. Oh my god. Wait. Wait, I have an idea.
Wait. A hook. Like this. And then it I'll make a a, a box. Yup. And then big rock. It was the right idea, though, right? Wasn't it? Big rock. You have to make the you have to make the triangle tall because it needs leverage. So you go a deep hook like that, and then you make a little receptacle for the ball, right? And then. Oh. You may find yourself living in a shotgun shack. This isn't DMCA, is it? It's Kermit. Behind the wheel of a large automobile, you may find yourself in a um. beautiful house with a beautiful wife. And you may ask yourself, Well, how did I get here? Letting the days go by, letting the water hold me. Oh, I down. stopped this. Make a cage. It's not gonna fucking work because then I can. I don't think you guys are understanding the gravity part of this game. How do I work this? You may ask yourself, where is that large automobile? And you may tell yourself, this is not my beautiful house. And you may tell yourself, this is not my beautiful wife. Letting the days go by, let the water hold me down. Letting the days go by, water flowing under. Where's the ball? <laughs> oh, it's, it's behind me. Same as it ever was. Yeah. Terrible. <laughs> so how do I stop these from falling? Because now I can't touch the left one. It's going to make it. Just give it a second. Timing was crazy. What kind of timing was that? Oh my god. Oh, all right. Only three more, and I'm getting better. I'm ge guys, I'm getting better. Okay. Does this fall if it's touched? Oh. Touch it. Is this a clueless? So I was going to say, if I could send this in, I could tilt this, right? But... The problem is, if I have this here, then this ball is in the way.
You get what I mean? Just ramp it? Yeah, but it can't. Because then it does that. Hold on. I'm trying... Can the triangle not fall? It falls if you touch it. Which means I'm trying to find a way to make it a ramp. But... Yeah. Why isn't he just pushing the ball? Because then it's going to go in here. Watch, and now it does this, but the other ball is in the way. You see what I mean? Push the purple ball with the triangle. What do you mean? The devs tweeted this level is bugged. It's impossible to solve right now. You know what? I thought that, but I wasn't sure. side. Yes. Boom! Oh my god. Oh! Oh my god. So now I have a ramp, but I can't get it up there. I feel like I'm missing something very simple on this one. Can I lift this up like this? Like, no. Small balls bounce? <laughs> Doing? <laughs> what do you mean they bounce? You're not telling me to go in there, right? It's not gonna... Off the corner of the pyramid? What, like this? But then it dies.
You had the right idea earlier? I'm so lost. Hold on. Listen, I didn't take physics, okay? We're all learning here together. <laughs> okay? Maybe... How high does the highest dot bounce? I don't think it does bounce. So, like, if I get this here, and then I'm able to do like this, that's like a ramp, but I don't think this bounce is like, it won't go up. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm trying to get it to go up this ramp, but, but I keep missing. Bounce the white dots? Oh my god. Okay. I see it now. It's just... I don't think this is the correct way. <laughs> but this is what we're doing. This is so stupid. This is so stupid. You all know that, right? Oh! This is so annoying. This is so hard. Dude, because if I do it from here, it has to be big enough and I have to aim it. That's not funny. It has to be a big rock. If it's not a big rock, it doesn't go fast. Oh my god! 130. 130. Fine. Still get two more. Two more and then I get my grade. Left wall? Oh, good boy. What the fuck? Oh, wait. get it though right like you get you get the idea right you you understand right
Like... You are actually so close. Really? Like... But the problem is, like, what I could do is, like... Do this, and then make this ramp. So it, oh wait, if you totally flip it though. Wait, I'm, dude, there's gotta be a way. Rotation enough with the rock. <laughs> It would be like... But how do I get it on the left? Like, I can build it like this, right? And then it's just, it's there. And then if I hook this, it goes. But then how do I get it over there? Then triangle on the right. What, just like this? But then how do I get it to push? If there's a way to spin this like this, but tall, thin triangle, and then just drop it. What, like this? You think? How is that gonna? Oh my god. Wait. No? Big rock on top right corner. Good one, dumbass! How do you get it out? I'm so confused. This is a friend from, this is a, a solution from good friend of the stream, Meek Speedy. A two? But how do you touch it? How? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I see. Wait, didn't I already do this? Like, just... Rocket 
never changes. Good old rock. <laughs> Tighter hook. What does that mean? I can't get it any tighter. I'm doing it as good as I can. From lower in the cup, what, like here? No. I could just rock and just knock it over. That's something. Okay. Make a claw for the right side, not a hook. I'm so sick of this claw business. Your guys' claw claw posting has been pissing me off. What, like this? Claw. Oh, good one, jackass. <laughs> That was your fault, not me. Wait, I have an idea. Well, well, well. <laughs> Look at that. Wonder what my IQ is. Now remember, this is for fun and not a real IQ test. So, just so you know, you know I'm taking a real IQ test and it gave me like 120, you know, 125, you know what I'm saying? But average is fine for this fake one. The shrewdness of having multiple functions and whatnot. Dude, I got mad insight. Wise enough to see that it's actually simple. Mmm. Why streamer? I'd say so. That is what I'm known for. <laughs> my wisdom. That's me. Yup. That's my... That's that's my bag. <laughs> oh, dude, I should have done this. The game will teach you me. What? I should have just done this before. Nice Arby's logo. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> this is actually so easy. I should have done this before the... Uh... I should have done this before I did the IQ test. Touch the left wall with your drawing. Draw a stick and let it drop. Play Q2 now? There's a Q2? How many stages does Coney finish? Over 20. Under 20 or over 20? Over 20, obviously. You thought I was going to give up? I never give up. Uh, 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 that's so many stages. Oh, my God. Dude. How, how about the meat? Secret one. Oh, dude. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay. So these are just. Well, if, if you could just do this forever, right? If I could just do this on literally. This isn't bad, actually. Because I could just do this all the way down, right? Wait, how do I get the horizontal ones in there? And also, I didn't get the bottom. Oh. How? Literally how? 
Oh wait, it's Peggle. <laughs> Never mind. I forgot I could just do this. I keep thinking I had to do it in like one thing. We're playing Peggle now. Okay. <laughs> Hooray! How do I get in the middle? You have to get all the ones in the middle first. I see. This is so hard. You just put it in the middle. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> oh my god, it's midnight. What, Dude, why didn't you guys tell me? What the fuck? You guys were supposed to tell me. It's so late. Coney, it's midnight. Thank you. Okay. All right, listen. We're going to go... I'm going to go watch Street Fighter. 10-0 is running Street Fighter. Okay? We're going over there. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Last stream before I go on vacation. So you better show up. Or I'm going to be so mad at you. I'm going to be so angry if you don't show up. And I'll know. I'm going to take attendance. Don't skip out tomorrow, okay? I'm going to get so mad, dude. Pikmin 4 demo. Yes, obviously. I know. I said I was doing it. Go watch Tenno. I'll see you guys tomorrow. What if you don't stream? I will stream. I have to stream. I'm leaving on vacation. Goodbye. Oh, wait. I left on the music.